I don't want right. to. What's the Welcome word? to Roleplay Cafe. We are playing hey. Old School Essentials, Joth, session number 44, or maybe 43C or something. Ah, no, no, no. Because we got, we got 44. We got two new characters. We're not new, but Unger Roth, myself, yep. and Elroy joins us as Osric. And we will hand yes. it over okay. to our GM here. All right. Uh, just a, a quick thing uh, armor class and hit points for both of you guys. Yes, mm. my armor yeah. class is 15. Mm -hmm. uh, with the chainmail and sixteen, if I have the shield, mm -hmm. and okay. eight eight hit points. Woo uh, I've got chain and shield makes my armor class sixteen as well. No mm -hmm. modifier for dex. My hit points are six. I'm a first level, by the way, first level dwarf. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, anyways, yes. So, um, how's your bottom? And you have heard the tale of. A bounty uh, out for a, a bandit known as the Kraken, mm -hmm. right? and he's 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 known as the Kraken because he has one tentacled arm. Okay, right. Tales say that he was cursed by the the Pixies uh, last year sometime, and well, he's eventually taken on the the life of a bandit and okay. gathered some similar minded folks with him. He's said to be hanging out in the East Wood, which is south of Cricket Bottom. Okay. Let's see here. Where's our mappy, mappy, mappy? There we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, All right. right. Here we go. Did we change? The How East Woods. Yeah, the East Woods. It doesn't look like it's very woody there, but it actually is. Okay. okay. It's mm -hmm. a. It's a really now. This it's is late winter time. Yes. Okay. So lots of snow on the ground. There's just been a. Uh, big blizzard in the last couple of days. And from your viewpoint in the hills overlooking Lake of Talons, you can see that even though it's wintertime, that lake isn't frozen. And locals will tell you that it never freezes for some reason. <laughs> in the middle of it, you see the three talons poking out of, the, out of the depths of the water. And you might even be able to see a little bit of the smoke rising from the, from the, the village of uh, Blackfish Bay there to the south. Mm -hmm. And what you'll also see is the wax spreading from the north around the east side of the lake and uh, the west side, although it doesn't seem to want to go around that tower that's at mm. the north side of the, of the lake. All right? Okay, so long story short, you two meet up and, uh, you know, think maybe it's a good idea if, if, if you go look for this guy, the Kraken, or at least scout things out. In the woods. <laughs> so, all right. yes. Uh, all right. So, so I've already met Ungar. Yeah, we'll say that you already already met. And Ungar is what a fighter. Uh, I am a. I am a. Uh, well, can't you tell? I am such a such a, the perfect representation of a dwarf. Ah. Uh, and uh, and yes, I am garbed in chain and shield and carry a mace, a dagger on my hip. Uh, and I am uh, have been known hereabouts to tell tales of uh, how I survived the Manticore Caverns, but nobody seems to care. <laughs> yes, oh, it's such a stalwart companion. Then I suppose mm -hmm. we should set off and find this Kraken and bring him to justice. Yes, and uh, you are a male uh, fighter. Uh, yes. Human. Uh, I mean, I, I'm not. Oh, yes. Okay, human fighter. Okay. Yes. All right. Awesome. So, yes, I believe two well-equipped fighters can handle this. No problem. What can go wrong? So, Osric is, is basically dressed like a, a Norman knight. Yes. A conical helm with nasal, uh, chain mail. Love it. Uh, Bernie and, and the, the coif, right? The, the, hoof, the hood that covers his face on the helmet on top. Clean-shaven black hair uh, and bears a uh, sword and... Uh, the the teardrop uh, uh, yep. shield of the mm -hmm. yeah yeah of oh, the right. Yes. Nice, nice. Okay. And where so, are we exactly, Todd? I missed that. We are we're actually. You guys are. You guys are in Brickett Bottom. Oh, we're at. Okay, we are at Brickett okay. Bottom. Okay. So we're going to uh, we're going to make our way down to the Eastwood, mm -hmm. and then you'll have to figure where you want to enter it. Okay. We'll see what happens. Yeah. Let's. Right? Uh, how much of this area would I have? Because I, I escaped the Manticore Caves on the on the 
east, the west side of Lake of Talons, I worked my way around. How yeah. much of this area would I have seen getting to Brickett Bottoms? Uh, you would have probably had to have gone uh, down on the southern end of the lake and around. Okay. Because because of the wax, you wouldn't so have been able have to approach the that. Main, I would have taken the main road up to Brickett Bottom there. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. That's, that's good gone through the Smaragdon Woods, which is where this crazy cult of, of uh, druids hang out. Okay. Um, and to the, yeah, to the to the west of that woods is Maiden's Falls, where okay. you where you uh, battled yes. the Manticore a while <laughs> yeah. back. All right. Battled yeah. is so a you, very uh, nice thing to say. I was, I was being generous. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, so you've made your way down around uh, Blackfish Bay, and, and you've seen how much um, building has been going on since the portal opened. It's, right. it's, it's grown a bit, all right, uh, and made your way past the Long Bank Hunting Lodge. Maybe even you, you know, uh, enjoyed some of their hospitality. They, they seem to be well known for their welcoming hospitality. Yes, I would have hunters. stayed, but they expected me to do grunt work for who knows how many months before they would have let me do the real McCoy. The real hunting of monsters, yeah. Yes, I was not so, going to cut firewood and skin game for anybody. God, for, no, no. So yeah, you would have made your way up past the edge of the East Woods, past the Good Night's Rest Inn, which is that abandoned, dilapidated inn mm -hmm. that leads... There's a road that leads off to, and, and you would have known of this, Sir Esborn's Mound. Right. Uh, which is, well, it's a it's a magnet for adventurers, but so far no one's come back from it. Uh, <laughs> it just disappeared. It's like flypaper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right? And of course, too, uh, uh, you would have heard of the, of the Black Dragon that's been seen in this region for the last, I don't know, eight months. Oh, man. Uh, but he's been kind of quiet over the winter. There haven't really been many sightings of him. So, yeah, up to Brickett's Bottom, you meet up uh, with Osric and make the decision, we'll say, to go go search for the, the Kraken. Okay. All right. So, Fernando, Unger, do you have a, a map of this region that I might peruse? Uh, I do not, but I have been through here. Uh, there is a... Uh, and again, I'm standing in snow here in the street that's up to my knees, but... Mm -hmm. Uh, as I, <laughs> I had no idea. I know it was a blizzard on the other side, but I point in yeah. the general direction of the good night's rest. I know along the on, along the road a place we could shelter if we cannot get to the east woods today. Mm -hmm. um, right. Yeah, it's we about... could probably get a map here at uh, the fingers the fingersmiths. Uh, the fingersmiths. Yes. They might have a map for us. Oh, or you yes. might sketch. Yes. yes. Well, 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 it's it, it's worth. Purchasing one for sure, particularly for me as I am new to this mm -hmm. area. But uh, you know, uh, hearing you describe the terrain, I would think this man being a bandit, he would seek uh, some position far away from this mm -hmm. lodge of hunters, mm -hmm. as they are well armed. Mm -hmm. And I presume their quarry is nearby, so they would avoid that area. Right. Perhaps mm -hmm. they would set up camp north of that to intercept trade. Uh, yes, that's a good point. Well, with the main road passing through, if I was a bandit, I would want a place I could easily ambush travelers. Yes. Maybe maybe the area between the Good Night's Rest and the mound there, or, or maybe uh, the rumor is he's in the East Woods. Yes, so perhaps between the Knights Inn uh, and the Long Fang Hunting Lodge. Yes, yes, that is that is where we will look. That is where we will look. All right. Okay. So you're gonna make your way down the road from from Brickett Bottom to the Good Knights Rest, which is about uh, four hours. All right. Mm -hmm. And let's see if we uh, we encounter anything uh -oh. along the way. Oh no! 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 All right, so you arrive at uh, probably just after midday at the Good Night's Rest. Okay. Here it is. Uh, and I'll, I would actually take Osric off the road. I might have stayed here on my travels to Brickett Bottoms, 
So I'm going <laughs> to drag him kind of off the beaten path and point this out. I may not just come all the way to it, but point mm-hmm. out this mm-hmm. old this old uh, inn that would be a good shelter if we need it. Yes. Well, very well. All right. Uh, so it's up to you. Uh, you, you. You probably know that you're not going to get all the way to the Long Fang Lodge before nightfall. Right. Ah, oh, then maybe we right? should rest here. Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. I don't know how so, deep the snow is, but as a dwarf, I'm sure I'm complaining a lot about the. Uh, well, let's see uh, how many inches. Of snow. Let's see how many inches of snow we have here <laughs> on a D. Well, it was a it was a it was a uh, blizzard. So here we go. Nine inches. Well, okay, that's not bad. Whoa. Nine inches of snow. Actually, there was a rap album called that back in the nineties. Yeah. The guy's name was Mark Snow. Nine inches of snow. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so you you would have to trudge through this this uh, this snow, uh, Mister Dwarf. Yeah, and uh, oh, of course. cursing the whole way. Yes, as I like being on the road where it's it's been trampled a bit, a little bit. Yes, uh, as I approach, uh, and, I will yes. uh, I will draw my mace and and slide my shield down just in case there uh, is trouble around this this uh, ruin. All right. Yes. Well, uh, let's see if there is any trouble around the ruin of the Good Night's Rest. Okay, seems to be abandoned on this uh, on this day. Good. Yeah, um, and and you can see that there's there's still the fireplace there. You yeah. can, uh, the, you know, others have lit fires there recently. Okay. It's a it's a well known spot. Okay. For travelers. Uh, for some reason, they've never rebuilt it. So, uh, is there uh, a floor it, above us, or is it exactly... No, the there's no floor. No, the, the floor ends at the top of those stairs okay, there. Okay, good. So there's no way right? somebody could be above us. Okay. Uh, no. Okay. No. Which means there's so no just, roof on this place, then, either. Uh, no, there's no roof. No. Damn. Okay. Well, then yeah. I will begin to uh, dig out the fireplace uh, mm-hmm. and, uh, s- and and uh, break some... Uh, some of these chairs or lumber and, and get and get a little fire started All if right. I can. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I, um, I, yes. I take the opportunity to look around and see what we have, and then uh, I'll approach Unger to help with the building of the fire and say, you know, uh, you might be right uh, if these bandits ambush people here. Mm. Uh, the fire will be a nice lure. Ah, oh, Perhaps good. we can conceal ourselves beneath the remnants of the stairs. Yes. And uh, make it smoke. Can, yes. And, um, if so they I, have lookouts, they'll see us. So they'll must, see the smoke. We must get a raging fire. Wet woods should smoke well. And I'll dig. Uh, I'll go outside the stone flooring here and begin to dig in the snow till I can get to ground. And try to tear up some turf, uh, some moss, okay. something that might smoke a lot. Once we get it, once we get the fire going, I'll throw some of this <laughs> on. All right. To make right. smoke. Right. I'll smile okay. at Osric. You, you are a smart man, Osric. Uh, what did you uh, do before you arrived here? Why did you leave Joth, Osric? I'm a stranger in these lands, in Far Erland. I was a, a guard at a castle, but. Uh, had ambitions for more Mm. and a desire to travel not much chance for a lone guardsman to make a fortune uh, Uh, back in Ireland you have come to the right place Uh, I have seen treasure unfortunately I could not keep my hands on it and the last the last time I did have treasure in my hands it was lost at the bottom of that lake not far from here that is that is quite a tale. Uh, but where there's some, uh, there will be more. We will get it. Yes. Yes. Uh, well, you've got lots of. I mean, it's you can it, you take as much time as you want to get a fire going. Mm-hmm. Um, right. Usually, it's a two and six chance that's to light it in one round. But you, you know, you take your time. And okay. Or yes. long, you'll have a you'll have a nice fire going, S- billowing up smoke through the fireplace. Right. Uh, uh, yeah. As as we cook, 
uh, our rations or at least warm them up for consumption i'll mm -hmm. i'll take that overturned table and the barrel and try to sort of make uh it's not exactly a fortified position, but kind of like a concealed position beneath the stairs. Okay. See if I can, you know, uh, the, the the idea is that at night uh, we might hide behind that. Mm -hmm. when they come looking at the fire, right? Okay. All right. Yeah. Very well. Yeah, so you uh, set up some sort of shelter with those that are or blind. And I'll, I'll step away at times from the fire the hearth and uh, watch toward the east woods to see if I see any, you know, any Actually. movement coming through the snow or, you know, at least until it gets dark. I'll kind of keep an eye okay. out as he's building a hideaway. Okay. So let's see if uh, we'll do two checks for that before dark. See if anything comes out of the woods. Uh-oh. <laughs> and... Uh, nope. Okay. You are good luck, Osric. <laughs> <laughs> so in time, the the sun sets, and uh, you're in the glow of that fire, mm -hmm. keeping yourselves warm. Well, they are. are they, they are not seeing our smoke, or they are not interested. Mm. Hmm. Are you going to set a watch, or? Um, we should set a watch. Yes. They might. I have a feeling if their lookouts have spotted our fire, they might come in, wait for cover of darkness. The light from the fireplace will surely guide them. I so, will. Uh, so I will stay by the hearth, by the heat, and I'll. I'll uh, you can bed down there uh, under the stairs in your hidey hole instead of here out in the open. So if they do come in. I can make enough noise to rouse you and they might not find you. Or we might both hide behind uh, uh, yes. what little we have. They'll come look at the fire and search yes. around. Once it's, we'll wait until it's dark and then take our positions. Yes. Then one of us can sleep and the other and be ready. Perfect. But yep, that's what we'll, we'll do. keep our weapons close. All right. So you're going to hide underneath the stairs. Yeah, uh, around okay. the. Uh, I'm assuming he piled some rubbish and stuff to kind of give us more obscure. Like the table and mm -hmm. the, and the yeah. barrel yeah. to sort of obscure view, right? So we can sit mm -hmm. or, or, or lie down there. All right. And at Thank least you. not be obvious from afar. Well, let's see what happens. First watch. So one of you is sleeping and one of you is awake. Yeah, I'll, I'll be awake uh, for yes. the first watch. Sure. Okay, sure. Here we go. Ooh. All right, and then you are awakened and change watch. Yes, and yes, and so I'll, I'll take the chance to don my armor right for when I when I need to watch. All right. Okay. <laughs> well, quiet evening. Nice. With nothing occurring, and the sun eventually rises. Uh, cold morning, and uh, your fire is low, mm. but. You were able to carry on to the East Woods. Nothing at all. Not even Nothing a fox did smell our... Not even a fox did it, um, investigate I'll, last night. After breakfast, I'll, I'll take a circle around uh, the area of the inn, see if there's any tracks, perhaps. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. No one came close. All right. Why don't you roll a six-sided dice for me? Six. No. Okay. All right. Well, it must have been because of that fresh snowfall in right. the last day or so. You're not seeing very much mm. tracks around here. All right. All right. So you can now continue down. Do we want to uh, enter the East Woods from the from the woods, or do we want to uh, make ourselves uh, vulnerable along the road and draw them out? What say you? I think we should go through the woods. Yes. I, I, I don't uh, want to be surrounded by his men. Exactly. We might parallel the road, but somewhat, mm -hmm. you know, inside the forest. Maybe we can spot their lookout before he spots us. Yes. Um, Unger, you, you 
also heard something else about these woods. Ah. That there's said to be a giant roaming around here, too. Oh, that's right. I, I, I will have filled him in about that before we left Bricky Bottom. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. Just so he would have been completely aware of the dangers he's getting into. <laughs> yes. Uh, but, All right. But I think... Uh, I assure, I assure you, uh, Osric, uh, if there is a giant, we will see it in plenty of time to hide. Don't you think? I hope so. <laughs> I hope so. All There's right, no giants in Erland, so. No, and I've heard this before. I mean, uh, to me, I, I've heard men refer to other men as giants, and and uh, well, they're just men. So mm -hmm. you know, this could be a, a bit of an exaggeration. I'm sure. Well, my cousin Leoric said he once met a dwarf, and uh, the dwarf told him that uh, they were practice at fighting larger beings. Uh, so mm -hmm. uh, I will look to your guidance if the worst should happen and we find ourselves in combat with this beast. Although I like your plan, <laughs> we'll avoid it if we can. Yes, if it is if it is large enough for us to spot, I, I'm sure I will not want to. There is no profit in trying to bring down a giant, is there? <laughs> no, I don't <laughs> think so. <laughs> All right. As you, uh, as you travel, now are you you're traveling, are you traveling down the road? No, um, I think we're going in the woods right to the east of the woods, of the road, so that we can be traveling sort of parallel to the road. Mm -hmm. right? Okay, all right. But so inside I'll, I'll... the forest, right? So they won't, hopefully they'll be looking at the road and we can just right. try and spot the lookout. Ah, nice. Okay. If Follow we get Lord. lucky. Okay, Follow all right. So uh, you come from the north. Yes. And uh, you can see the road continuing down there. The, this woods is, yeah, it's, it's uh, pine trees and uh, deciduous trees. It's very misty and um, veiled in, in, in mist, okay. and snowy, right? And very thick. Okay. Okay? Uh, very and, thick. Oh, no. Yes, very, very thick, even though there's no foliage on the trees. Mm -hmm. It's just... Uh, yeah, I'll be, I'll be keeping a, a close look, although it's misty, uh, for any potential smoke or um, lights of maybe fires into the woods. And uh, I'll be looking about for any fresh tracks in the snow as we move. Okay. Right, Keep, just, right. just in case we see something. Give different. me an idea of where you would, like, are you, are you just uh, going in or are you looking for a, a path? Um, well, we're kind of mm, kind of paralleling the road and skirting. I would think the uh, kind of the edges of the woods. Is that is that what you think, I, uh, Osric? That was that was my idea. Mm -hmm. We stick close to the road because any lookout would be within sighting distance. Right. You keep an eye. You keep an eye out for those tracks. I'll be looking at tall trees to yes. see if I can spot anyone. Okay. Uh, All right. Okay. So keeping parallel with the road. At about this point, okay, you do see a trail going in. Ooh. Now, yeah. if you're going to be on the trails, I'll I'll map it. Okay. Yes. If you go off the trails, then chances of something you know getting right. lost and not knowing what direction you're going in. Right, uh, right. I will. Uh, I'll kneel down and investigate. Does this look like a migration trail of, say, deer, animals, or does this look like a foot trail? Boot, like boot marks. Yeah, or... yeah. Uh, you definitely will see uh, boot marks here. Yeah, I'll stand and look at Os Osric. I'm not certain. I want to be on the trail. Maybe again, similar. We work our way deeper into the woods, paralleling this trail. What say you? It's long. As long as we don't lose sight of it, I think, I think it's a fine idea. Right. We can even cross it, maybe crisscross the trail. Okay. Sure. All right. All right. So you're gonna head in. Yeah, like maybe every, uh, like every twenty feet or so, we might cr slowly cross the trail to make sure we don't mm -hmm. lose it, and then parallel from the southern oh, side fine. of it, and then cross every twenty-five feet or so and parallel it from the northern side. Okay. And how far in are you going to go off the trail? Well, until we can 
hopefully find a camp or uh, maybe twenty feet, right? Twenty uh, feet. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. You mean off? Yeah, away yeah. from the trail. Yes, yes. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah twenty feet. 20, All right. Okay. Thirty feet tops. Okay. I would. I would think. Mm -hmm. So it's not okay. that far, but since the forest is very thick, mm -hmm. right? Hopefully we can. Oh yeah. Sort of keep. Okay. Hidden. Right. So you head on in. You can see that, right? Okay. Yeah. And go a little ways here. Let's see. Yes. Okay. So 20 feet, you said, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 20 feet. Okay. Traveling in a bit. Yeah. And eventually you do come to a clearing. Oh. Okay. All right. I'll I'll uh, I'll pause before I get into the clearing from the tree line mm -hmm. and uh, squat low. Uh, I don't wear a helm, so uh, my dark hair, my dark beard. Um, so I don't have a I don't have a a helmet that might reflect light. And, right. And um, I will uh, draw my mace and uh, pull my shield up tight. And as I peer around, seeing if I can see any evidence of. Uh, Animals, people, and I'll, I'll yes. kind of, I'll kind of get Ostrich's attention. I'm sure he sees it as well. Mm -hmm. What you see in this clearing is, it's almost like scarecrows. Hmm. Right. Uh, there are horse scarecrows, um, and there's not that many horses in this area. Like you know what I mean? Like it's like mm -hmm. either horses or deer set up looking menacing there's other bones that have been gathered together and and erected as as some sort of scarecrow with with uh hides on them okay standing there kind of blocking the way looking quite frightening this is a warning osric what do you think this is a way of warning people off warding people off Probably is. I have never encountered anything like this before. All right. Um, it's just eight thirty. I have to go tuck in my son. Oh sure. All right. Go for it. So oh, I'll sure. be I'll be right back. Hold on. Sure, sure. 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 <laughs> All right. Okay. So now there's just two of us. No hirelings. No henchmen. <laughs> <laughs> I've got. It's imports. weird. <laughs> it feels weird. I think that's the interesting thing about. The Barrow Mace game, it's like I, I'd forgotten what it was like to play with Old like school. five people yeah. and a bunch of retainers, and it's it's great. Yeah. It's amazing. It is. It's I'm a very different feeling. It is, yeah. and I haven't done it. I have not done it. Um, now, I've had some big tables in the last 14 years, but I didn't like, I didn't do a lot of real dungeon crawling, le legitimate dungeon crawling. So, but yes. uh, no, not since we were kids, man. Uh, However, we didn't do it right as kids, really. <laughs> that I was thinking precisely that today. I think part of the enjoyment is the us being Adults, grown up, mature, right? and, yeah. and, and and now having the discipline yeah. to follow all the procedures and keep track of everything. Yeah. And it's, yeah. it's just enhancing the whole experience. It is amazing. It's fantastic. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All and right. we're back. Okay. So. Let's see. Uh, uh, you will all yes. No, I was just thinking. I was just going over in my mind that we're looking at scarecrows, right? And mm -hmm. yes. bones with hides standing up. Okay. Yes. So nice. I will, you know, I will loosen up. Uh, I, I'll sheath my sword and draw my short bow, and ready an arrow, right? As mm -hmm. we're standing in this clearing, and I'm again, I'm I'm looking at trees beyond. To see if there's any lookouts that I can spot, okay, or even looking at the scarecrows, right? Uh, uh, the, you know, could any of them be some sort of figure hidden? I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna make a snowball. I'm gonna whisper to us, Os Osric. I'm gonna, I'm going to throw a snowball at one of the bone, uh, one of the, the bone scarecrows. Right. So I ball up a oh, right. snowball, you know, nice and hard. And I'm going to mm -hmm. pitch it at one of these, the closest bone, uh, not the deer or the horses, but one of these bone hide things, if I can. Okay. Sure. Do I need to roll to hit? Um, 
No, no. Okay. Uh, you, you lob a, a snowball at they're standing still. They're not moving around. They're mm. scarecrows. And let's see. Is it a scarecrow? <laughs> snowball bounces off it. It's a, it's a scarecrow. You'll also see um, another trail Ooh. going off the path. Going out off the clearing, sorry. Mm -hmm. And it goes this way. Okay. Do you see any tracks in this clearing, friend Ungar? Particularly... Uh giant tracks yeah i will uh i'll make my you 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 train the bow stay where you're at train the bow in my direction in case i need cover and i will uh skirt along this this clearing right uh, and i'll try to get as close to that trail as i can looking for footprints or you know uh all well, six side days okay hmm. Wow. Okay. So, um, yeah, you, you skirt around the edge of the clearing, and uh, you don't see anything out of the ordinary, just the, the thick okay. thickets of, of woods beyond. I will... Uh, this path... Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Yeah. I'll, I'll work my way back to Osric. Um, I am not seeing any evidence of giant tracks, but it is indeed a new trail. And then I'll nod in the direction of one of these bone... Uh, those hides, we might well mm -hmm. be able to hide under those hides. Um, maybe we uh, cloak ourselves in these hides and work our way through the woods. We mm -hmm. might appear menacing like animals, maybe. We mm. might. We might. Are All there right. any, any any rumors of savage tri tribes in this Eastwood? Goblins no, no, no. Oh, well. I'm sorry. Yes. Um, there are said to be kobolds mm. uh, living in the woods, as well as wild elves. Okay, okay. Not sure. Nice and friendly. Right. You know. I will, uh, so I'll go over and uh, investigate up close one of these these scarecrows wearing the bone, wearing the mm -hmm. hide. All right. Take a uh, look. See if I'll, there's any markings about right. elves. I'll look for or... marks. I'll look for tool marks. As a dwarf, maybe I can spot tool marks if they use tools to craft these things. Um, yes, and then I'll yes. shake them out. Uh, if it looks like I can maybe remove one of these hides easily, mm -hmm. I will. Um, uh, and my goal is to can. push it. You know, put it around my shoulders and over my head, like I look. You know, right. kind of disguise. They're bound me. with with twine and rope. Okay. Set into the ground. Okay, so I will pull my dagger free and cut the twine. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to save some of the twine, and I'll uh, again I'll cloak myself in it. I'll uh, put some of this twine in my backpack. You never know. And right. uh, I'll ask Isaac, how, how do I look, Osric? Thank you. Uh -huh. look, uh, uh, certainly foreboding and and menacing in this in this dark garb mm. uh is no john? writings no is john in the house i am oh there john he is, is in okay. the house okay apologize for coming mm -hmm. in a uh, sentence in role playing <laughs> uh, yeah <laughs> mid sentence. all right What's well up, john hey how you doing good 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 yeah Let's so uh the game here yeah the guys have just uh, started edging into the east wood they've found a clearing that has some sort of bone and hide scarecrows that have been set up by who knows who and they're just kind of uh, i think they're 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 putting on some of these now and dressing up as these <laughs> i am i'm not certain Osric, you are. Uh, yeah, I, 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 I don't, I don't uh, think uh, Osric's willing to uh dirty himself in such a way yeah Mm -hmm. I'm more concerned with any markings on it, any writings, uh, anything that might give us a clue to their origin. Is, is, is this humans did this, or is it elves, or even kobolds? Yes. Well, they're human size. Right. Right. So maybe not the kobolds. Mm. Uh, and you can see indications because of the type of rope used 
there's uh, different styles of rope. It's just not, you know, rough twine. You know, like mm-hmm. there's even like old silken rope. Mm. You know, little, little pieces of that used too, right? Mm. So your guess would be human. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. Um, I'll of course relay that to Osric. Um, and I'll show him some of the knots, maybe, um, and the ropes. Right. Yeah, it looks as though they might be a hodgepodge of human. Um, these knots, well, and I'll point out the knots. These are knots that uh, I don't believe kobolds make knots. Uh, John, well, are you using at least George, or using your your ranger? Uh, G- George. George. Okay. All right. So here's what we'll do. While you two are doing that, you you hear a uh, a noise coming from over in this direction, uh. and presently, an individual comes stumbling out of the thicket, looking uh. a little. Yeah. That that be you, uh, uh, you know. A little worse for wear, uh, you know. Maybe your hair's all messed up from getting it caught on branches and stuff. <laughs> uh, you were separated from your companions, who also came in the woods looking for the kraken. All right. So maybe you'll describe your character to. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah Unger will immediately face. squat down uh, under this hide, and, and peer out. So I'll look like a heap of maybe a dead animal or something, right? Oh, okay. All right. And uh, Osric? I will draw my bow and point it at him, mm. right? And and sort of uh, uh, lean next to a s- scarecrow, right? So it's some sort of <laughs> meager shelter, at right. least. But I'll, you know, I'll, I'll draw my, my bow. And as soon as I realize that he's alone, I will say, uh, stand fast, Sarah. Uh, I whoa I I don't I don't mean any trouble I'm just uh, a bit turned around I, uh, I I I lost some of my uh, my friends in the woods here and he uh, so George is uh, you know has his hands raised he's uh, rather uh, life and you can see that you can make out the fact that he's wearing uh, some chain mail uh, under a very ornate uh, dirt that he has stretched tight over it. Um, he has a, a lyre slung over his shoulder and a sword in his scabbard. Okay. You can see a crossbow hanging from his belt. Uh, but he raises his hands and as I, <clears throat> so what brings you two fellas out here? And it's fine clothing you're wearing, right? Because it's an ornate uh, mm-hmm. shirt. So. Uh, yes, it's uh, not not very suitable for adventuring. <laughs> but it's fine looking. Like you look like a man of at least you know average means, if not uh, slightly wealthy, right? Yes, on the wealthier side. So I'll I'll. I'll release the tension on my on my bow and say you seem finely dressed for a bandit I'll poke oh, my I'm no bandit sir <laughs> I'll poke my head out from under the hides now you'll see this uh, dark bearded uh, scraggly long dark hair dwarven face poke out no Osra can you see he is not a, he has escaped the crack in the poor man he has probably been a captive and I'll stand mm. uh, and I'll throw the hide down at my feet don't worry, we are here to rescue you. Uh, you have been victimized, I bet, by the bandits. Um, I don't know, Todd. Have, have I been victimized, or I just lost them? Looking no, you just lost. lost my you, have, you have lost in the woods. <laughs> yeah, um, you got separate. Well, because, <laughs> yeah, got separated from the others. All right. Victimized is is a strong word. Um, <laughs> <but> <laughs> well, uh, you are not. Just you are a bit not uh, discombobulated. Escaping. Then, then what uh, is I'm not what, escaping what, what, for them. Oh, no. I'm uh, I'm I'm hunting. Uh, 
a man that goes by the name Kraken. Ah, uh, you too. I believe so you are, he has. So you are a competitor, and I. Uh, you'll see me lay my hand on the top, of the head of my mace. I won't draw it. It's it's in my belt, but I'll lay my hand. So you are a competitor then, after the same bounty that we are. Uh, well, uh, I'm not out after the bounty per se, but I'm trying to uh, exchange him for the freedom of uh, of a fine lass. Mm. How As much, you say how that, how much was the bounty, by the way, Todd? Just out of curiosity. Oh, for the for the kraken? Yeah, it was three hundred. Three hundred gold. Is this yep. lass worth three hundred gold? Oh, she's worth a fortune. Oh, she's a princess. I'll tell then. you, she is a princess. <laughs> she is the daughter of a lord. In, in my eyes, she is. Do you plan on <laughs> ransoming her? What What do you believe you can ransom her for? Um, uh, no, I'm. I, I I hope she will take me as her husband. <laughs> I don't want to ransom her. Oh, uh, you'll see my shoulders droop, and I'll look at Osric. Damn, it is a man in love, Osric. Well, I was just going to say, as you're having this discussion, all of a sudden, you hear a bellow coming from down that next path. Mm -mm. It sounds like it's in the distance, okay, echoing through the woods, but it's definitely some sort of deep, guttural bellow. Hmm. Come, minstrel. I, I, I lowered my voice. Come, minstrel, join us. Let's get off the clearing. If you'll have me, I would be delighted. I'll, I'll, I'll move. I'll motion to the guys to move uh, northeast, okay. like not exactly on the new path, but kind of in between the old path and the new. Okay. Uh, okay. Let All us right. hide. Like right here. Yeah. Between the right two there. paths. Okay. Yeah, 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 that's okay. about it. So uh, this is a six-mile hex. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, yeah. But in that, that direction, right? So, mm -hmm. so uh, yeah. as not to, I don't want to be in the clearing when whatever it is comes. Right, right. Wondering about. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> All right. It, just a quick question, Todd. Is yeah. there a... Is there a reason these are different colors? Do they, does that yes, because uh, the red means it's a more difficult path. Okay. All right, you're at you're at half speed. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. For okay, me, gotcha. Yeah, so it's a very uneven path. Okay. So you're gonna go in between. Yeah, just out of the clearing. So just just at least until we get our. our you know, organized and see if, if the bellows materializes something, right? Right. Uh, okay. Well, let's well, see. Well, Minstrel, I don't think you'll be you'll manage to capture this Kraken by yourself. I am Osric of Erland. Uh, and my the, friend is uh, Ungar of the Dwarf. Yeah, I am the Ungar Roth of the, uh, the, the Dwarf people, obviously. Yes, as you can see. Uh, if uh, are, are you are you capable of paying the bounty? Uh, we will help you get uh, get him. But uh, are you willing to pay us uh, our share of the bounty in gold? I would be more than willing to discuss that if we capture him. Ah, hmm. kind of a half glass half full kind of man. Are you, George? Uh, well, I try not to make too many long-term decisions the fortune can turn on a dime but this is I, I have seen it i have seen it all right so as you're having this discussion all of a sudden you now hear let me see is it coming towards you or going away it's whoa well, it's coming towards you oh. all right you can hear <laughs> trees cracking oh splintering i think this is a rather large creature that is Headed our way. I think this is the giant we heard rumors and, of, Osric. And you can also see through the thickets, you can see something ahead of it on the path coming towards this. Oh, geez. This which, quickly, which way's the wind blowing? Oh, yes, okay. Right, right. Let's see. Uh, <laughs> north will be a one, and. Uh, what do we got? Six sides. Okay, so six will be over here. Okay, so here we go. Six sides. 
And the wind is coming from the one, two, three, four. It's coming from the south. Yes. From the south. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Excellent. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah. Um, so, um, yeah, so the wind's coming from the south, and, yeah, something is crashing through the woods, coming down this uneven path. And we can see something Having, is in front of it. Something is in front of it, okay. yes. Okay. Quick, hide and be quiet. I maintain my bow, right? And I, mm -hmm. again, I have an arrow not, but not drawn. Right. But but I'm I'm trying to lean up against a tree or something to... Yeah. Uh, so I'm headed for the nearest out of sight. tree, uh, dagger out, and I will uh, tr attempt to climb the nearest climbable tree. Big enough to handle me, but not so big I can't climb it. Okay. All right. Uh, it should be easy enough to find a tree that you can get up in. Mm -hmm. um, and George, George is going to step off the trail uh, slightly to the north uh, to stay out of <laughs> the way of whatever is, you know, trudging and destroying all these trees and is going to ready his crossbow. Okay. Oh, huh. all right. So, momentarily, you see two uh, gentlemen in leather armor, kind of patchwork leather armor, running for their lives <laughs> down the path uh, towards this clearing. And they are being chased, yes, by a giant who's having quite a difficult time kind of getting through the, the this uneven path, which is a little too small for him. Okay. So that's why the, the crash of the trees and such. Hmm. Is he wearing, like, animal hides? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> so they, they run into the clearing. <laughs> And they make their way over to this side of the clearing. Okay. Oh. And they move the thicket. They move the thicket. Yeah. At the edge of the clearing. Yeah. So I it's a so yeah. It's almost like a secret passage. Yes. In okay. the thicket. Right. Yes. Yes. I uh, whistle through my teeth down to Osric, and I nod in that direction to make sure he has seen it. And they both step inside and, and draw it back over the over the opening again. Hmm. Okay. Presently, uh, a rather large creature comes uh, barreling into the into the clearing with, uh, yeah, wearing hides and the, the club and, and all that. And uh, yeah, so he is about twelve feet tall. No. This guy, uh, and he immediately sees the, you know, he's pushing trees apart to get into here. Right. He sees the scarecrows, and he starts wailing on them and smashing them all out of the way. Wow! Screaming, bellowing at at at, at them, and. Uh, he kind of looks around, trying to get his bearings. He sees the other path that you came in on, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. right? And he starts to make his way down that path, having an easier time because it's a little, little uh, wider, right? Mm -hmm. Let uh, me see here. I will scurry yes. down the tree uh, to the ground and uh, motion as I run across the clearing for this thicket. Um, come guys, let's, let us hide in this, and, and let's use the uh, same escape route, and I'll, uh, cross this clearing, headed for the thicket. Let's see how good of a listener our, our giant friend is. Oh, 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 oh. Must have a big wax build up in his ears. Uh, <laughs> so, he can't hear you, doesn't hear you, okay. and continues on his way down that path. So I will hurry yes. after Unger. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and George will follow. Mm -hmm. Stowing my bow and, and arrow. Mm -hmm. All right. And uh and, we'll get to this yes. thicket, we'll we'll pull it loose, pull it free. Okay. 
Yeah, and it's the size of a of a doorway in the thicket, right? And it's a uh, it's a woven, you know, branches okay. and such, mm. made to look quite natural. Mm -hmm. All right. So and beyond, you see, yeah, you see another trail mm. going deep into the thicket. All right, uh, I'll uh, duck my head and uh, kind of squatting. I'll I'll move through uh, the mm -hmm. thicket, um, headed on the old the other trail, uh, looking about for uh, if they are if there's anyone you know in the immediate vicinity. Right. Okay. Um, Can I close. motion uh, to George? Move, minstrel. I'll cover up and I slide the the thicket cover. Uh, to right. seal the end of the tunnel again. Oh, okay. All right. All right. George had, you know, George follows the instructions and has his crossbow in hand, still loaded. Mm -hmm. All right. And it's very tunnel-like in here. Okay. All right. They've they've cleared this just enough so that you know you have to crouch down a little bit to make your way through it. All right. And what is your marching order? Well, I'll be first. Uh, George in the middle. Because it's just wide enough for one person to walk. Okay, so I'll be yeah, going so. first. Uh, George in the middle, I guess, and and Ostrich yeah. is taking up the back, right? Sure. He okay. can always shoot over my head. I'm only four foot something. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. So you start uh, walking down the snow-covered pathway. Uh, you can see the. The footprints of the two individuals that came in here. Okay. Make an intelligence check, Hunger. Okay, here we go. My intelligence is a whopping um, 11, so I'm better than average. Let's give it a go. Okay. Mm -hmm. Did it roll? I didn't see it. Uh, there it not yet. Oh, One. okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> You see the the footprints go in about ten feet, and then very purposely step to the left mm. on the path. I'll uh, stop, and then I'll very quietly turn and uh, I'll point to my eyes for mm -hmm. them, and then I'll point to their to the evidence where they stepped off uh, stepped out of this pathway to the left. All right, okay, and then I'll make my way just a little bit past that. Uh, so if it's uh, let's say it's on the left, I'll pass it yeah. and get on the uh, you know the other side of this area. So George could then be opposite me. Okay, so George is going to be on the right. And you're going to be on the left. Right, that's it. Yep. Pressed up against the wall, so kind so of. Speak. Yeah, right. Uh, okay. Thicket. All right. Yeah. Yep. All right. Uh, is Follow that a the door, door or an opening? Right. Let's say that again. No, I think it's avoiding something on the floor. It might be a trap. Yeah. Step carefully, follow the footsteps, and I'm keeping my voice low. Right. Uh, so it's okay. not a doorway that, that they went into. No. Oh, no. They have no. No. You can see their footprints. The I see. To the left. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'll, so I'll do exactly that. I'll I'll shuffle along where they shuffle along. Okay. I got gotcha. you. All right, and. Uh, I don't know, probably five feet after that, they step back onto the center of the path <laughs> okay. and continue their way. All right. Good. Huh? They've laid traps. This is their escape tunnel. Yes. Or an entrance into their lair. I'm not sure which. Yes. Um, and I'll Do keep moving uh, cautiously, mm -hmm. quietly, uh, again, watching for these footprints to see if they cue us again. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And sure enough, after a little while, it does the same thing. They step to the right. Okay. All right. And we will do the same. I will point it out okay. to them, and we'll all shuffle on the right side. And perhaps we should make markings as to where these are so that we don't need to follow the footsteps. In case, the In case we need melt to. Soon, so. Good, good. Um, uh, I'm going to pull out a dagger and just, you know, kind of grape into the stone a little arrow pointing down at 
the previous place where we stepped off to the side. Okay. Okay. All right. And uh, do the same on this second one. Okay. Perfect. Super. All right. Yeah. So you've marked those two areas. Good. All right. Uh, the path continues on. As such. Okay. Moving slowly, cautiously, and watching mm -hmm. for those footprints. Listening as well. Um, in case we begin to hear evidence yes. of uh, people or, or okay. civilization or something. All right. And I occasionally glance back, right, to see if the, if the opening that we came in through opens again, right? If somebody else is coming in or something. Right. Okay. Very well. Yeah. Okay. So, it's at this point there is a fork in the path. Mm. One goes that way, one goes that way. Okay. Um, <laughs> where do the footprints go? Well, one set goes in either direction. No. Oh, boy. Oh, wow. Okay. I am I am stumped. Uh, the path to the left strikes me that it might circle back around in the direction the, you know, too far to the east. They originally, might, came. right, right. It might circle back around in the direction they were, at least east anyway, and to the west. Uh, maybe that uh, uh, George came stumbling out of the woods. Uh, where was George? When did George stumble into the clearing from what area? From the west? Uh, George came from the west, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so I'll... I'll uh, when, yeah, I don't know, gentlemen, which which is the best path to take. Do, did, uh, did we oh, get it? I mean, how much information... Or, or, I mean, how good of a... Oh, wait. Did Todd just... Have my phone's ringing. Hold on. Oh, okay. All right. No problem. <laughs> well, your reasoning is sound, but it might be the other way around. Uh, okay. They did run into the clearing here and enter the tunnel. Right. If there were a closer way, maybe they would have taken it. But then again, who knows when the giant, when they stumbled upon the giant. Correct. Yes. So your, your guess is, a, is, a, is as good as mine. We know that east would take us deeper into the east woods. And I would assume West would take us closer to the Long Fangs camp. Did it, any of you get a good look at these two fellows and uh, of their general size uh, in comparison to one another? A, a humanoid, I believe, a human in stature, not unlike yep. yourselves. Mm -hmm. But that's uh, well, I couldn't tell you if they were actually. But there was two. Humans. Yeah, was there? Was there? There was two of them, and so did did we get? An idea of how big each of them are? Average sized humans. Okay. No. okay, but one wasn't significantly bigger than the other one. No. Okay. No, it wasn't Fafford and the Grey Mouse. No. Right. So it's <laughs> probably right. it's probably not the wild elves we heard about. Right. Must be the bandits most likely. Ah. Oh. oh, so you think I we're know close to the lair of Kraken? Boy, that would be fortuitous be. Well, if that is true. Yeah. If one of them is the Kraken, they know him to be a rather large man. Oh. Yes. That is good to know. And he was described in the bounty as having a tentacled arm. I did not notice a tentacled arm on either of these men. Yeah. No. no. Well, he, we were uh, being chased by, or at least they were being chased by a giant. Mm -hmm. I would imagine he would keep that concealed. At least I would if yes. I had a tentacle arm. That's a very good point. Um, so we know east would go so, deeper into the east woods. The west mm -hmm. might take us closer to the Long Fang camp. Which is it? Um, where are you uh, from, think... George? Where did you come from? The Long Fang camp is, uh, was uh, where we departed from to begin our hunt. Um, so my suggestion would be we head east. I think the minstrel is right. If we head west, we'll, perhaps that leads to a further lookout spot by the road mm -hmm. and away from their lair. 
Okay. Uh, so I will, uh, I nod in agreement and I will lead the way uh, east. East. Yes. Okay. Again, watching these, if I can, wa watching the footprints oh. best I can. Right. Okay. Goes in that direction. And we'll just see if you, again, see any. Yes. Okay. You definitely come across another spot where they've stepped aside. Okay. All right. All right. And uh, we'll mark it again. Or we'll yeah. let George mark it. Yeah. And you also see another path reach uh, Twyna there. Whew. Headed south, huh? So, But, I, but it's a bright... I assume this is... Th th this is just a poorly lined up yeah, that's uh, just a, Oh, yeah, that's just a, yeah, okay. That's just, okay. that's just, yeah. X marks okay. the spot. So, <laughs> yeah, no, I got a little carried away there. All right, so this is this is the branch you're talking about. It goes down to the southwest into yes. the east. Yeah, yes. Okay. Yes. And to the south, uh, like southwest, I guess it is, you can see through the through the woods in this area here, uh, you can see some greenery. Hmm. And almost like a... It must be a small clearing of some sort. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, can't hurt to take a look. Quite uh, greenery. Not. The, um, the footsteps, do, do they head in that direction or do they continue east? They continue east. east. Ooh. And footsteps come up from that southwest path and join you. Oh, so somebody came out of the, out of that area. Okay, mm -hmm. yeah, it might be another clearing with mm -hmm. scarecrows, but there's only one way to find out. Yes. Uh, so yeah, let's check it. I'll uh, I'll lead the way uh, toward the greenery. Okay. Um, All right. Keeping my eyes peeled. Again, the tracks that came out of this area. I'll I'll, I'll mm -hmm. be on those in case there's uh, a trap. Okay. So you make your way, sorry. Yes, go ahead. Uh, you make your way into the woods a bit and just see how far in this this greenery is. Okay. Mm -hmm. How many feet? Hmm. Fifty feet. Okay, about fifty feet. So about fifty feet in, you will see a small clearing. It's it's. I'm just going to do it with a little bit of green here, like this. Okay. And you see a ring of mushrooms, hmm. uh, probably about three feet tall, each of them. In a, in there, it's it's cleared grass in this area, very very bright grass, bright green. And in the middle of uh, that clearing of in the middle of the mushroom circle, you can see an old tree stump, probably about four feet tall. Hmm. And it's kind of split down one side, and there seems to be some sort of mucusy sack inside the opening of it. Hmm. Did you yeah. say sap or sack? Sack. S A P. S A C. Hmm. Oh, S A C. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, uh frown a bit at that and shake my head I have not seen anything like this before. Uh, so the snow I'm assuming around all of it is melted. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Mm. I mislike the look of that. Mm -mm. My That's cousin Leoric says mushroom rings like this are markings of the fae. Mm -hmm. The fae folk. Uh, I would rather avoid contact with those mm. strange creatures if we can. Who knows what strange bargains they may yes. uh, impose upon us. Uh, yeah, it is unnatural that there is no snow here. It's clearly green and warm. Yeah, I'll take a couple of steps back away from it. Okay. And uh, away from the clearing, and I'll look at George. What do you know of it? Okay, you got, you got lore, don't you? Yes, I do. Yeah, okay. All right. 
So what do you have to I roll got for two that? In, two in six chance. Okay. Two in six chance. Nice. Like two. All right. Uh, you are of the opinion that that is a wild elf birth sack. Birth sack. They planted This is why I don't their, like elves. One of their, <laughs> they are, one of their they kind there. born from sacks from stumps. Exactly what I thought. We told you this was fey magic. It is fey. I think it is probably best we do not disturb this. We don't want the ire of any elves on us. You can see from where you're standing there's some sort of movement inside the sack very slow and you know, seriously. I suggest we leave. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, I'm already a couple of steps back down the trail. <laughs> as he said. Okay. After he said it's an elf birth sack, I have zero. <laughs> <laughs> I'm headed down the trail. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Yeah. All right. <laughs> as much as, as cool as it would be to see an elf be boring, uh, we probably wouldn't survive the experience. <laughs> That's so. right. That's right. <laughs> okay. The path continues. Well, it's a little different color. And it was. All right. Is there another? Yeah, we'll head to that. Nope. What's that? Okay. So we'll take that east no. path then that the uh, footprints headed down. This western branch ended here, right? On yeah. The trail. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 No. Let's go back east then. Okay. <laughs> All righty. We'll go back down east, following the path. <laughs> mm. Pardon me. <clears throat> right. Okay. Um, so you can start to see ahead the path starts, the woods start to clear out a little bit. There's obviously an opening ahead. Clearing of some sort. Okay. And you've also know you you've also come uphill in this area. Hmm. Okay. So we're gaining... Just to clarify, we, we we're still underground, right? You're not underground. You're you're in a, oh, in a oh, thicket. You're in a thicket tunnel. Okay. Okay. Right. All right. Made I of, got you. Made of the thickets, right? Okay. Yes. All right. I understand. All right. right. Okay. And we're headed uphill at a slight yeah. at a sliding yeah a slight grade. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I mean, okay. we'll continue, right? Uh, there's there's got to be a way out of here. Uh, watching what footprints again that I can, you know. Mm -hmm. Certainly. Uh, no other signs of any side steps or oh, jeez, forget right. that. I can't. I can't erase it without erasing everything. Oh no! Oh, okay. that's right. Oh, it's a it's a three way intersection. No, it is. Oh my god! Okay. No, 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 no. I thought you were an artist, Todd. What the oh hell? my gosh! I'm doing this with a mouse. So much okay. for the uh, so much yeah, for that facade. I know, that... I know eh? <laughs> okay, everybody, roll. I hear a noise. Roll. Hear a noise. Hear a noise. No. No. Oh, no. No. we're it's all deaf. New. Okay. <laughs> all right. Some of the giant earwax uh, yeah, right. <laughs> got clogged in our ears. <laughs> okay. Uh, but what you do here is a couple of low bird chirps up in the trees. Uh, <clears throat> my eyebrows raise. Something tells me those are not bird chirps. And I'll look above into the trees trying to see, uh, identify actual birds. <clears throat> okay. I'm going to fire my crossbow up into the trees and see if it scares the birds away. Whoa. Ah, Okay. That's one way to go about that. <laughs> okay. Sure. Uh, you might as well roll a twenty-sided dice because uh, you know, maybe you'll hit something. Yeah. I don't know. Big twenty. There it is. Seventeen. 17. <laughs> Seventeen. Okay. No, nope, not quite. But uh, yeah. So no birds take off. Uh oh. Yeah. Uh, 
Actually, I didn't add my uh, my oh. dex modifier plus one. Does that help? No, no, that doesn't. No. Okay. <laughs> no. Uh, okay. Does the chirping stop? Uh, yes, yes, it does. Yes, it does. This is this is this is not good. Um, so uh, I will I will pull my mace from my belt and slide my shield down from my shoulder, and uh, kind of continue down the path, but walking backward, kind of facing that area as I step backward. Okay. Let me see here. Okay. Ah. Uh, an arrow comes shooting out from the trees. Let's see. Oh, uh oh. Erland. Osric, sorry. Uh oh. Ah, okay, so it misses you. Woo! But it flies by you. All right? Yeah, so I raise my shield, right? Mm -hmm. once, once I, I see it. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. So. Let's roll initiative, see if you guys can see anybody, okay? Sure. So somebody roll through. I'll roll over here, too. Oh, uh, I got a six, baby. Uh, I got a three. <laughs> okay. Um, and, yes? Uh, 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 my uh, declaration of action, is that what we're doing now? Or Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it, would be to, uh, it would be to parlay. Uh, you know, kind of show my, my mace is in my hand, but bring my shield and hands up. Uh, who's there? We mean no, we mean no harm. We've come yeah. here to escape the giant. <coughs> giant. <laughs> you hear you hear some laughter up there in the trees. Uh, if you continue down this path, you'll have more though, to worry about than some giant, my friend. You will be in the clutches of the Kraken. Uh, <laughs> the Kraken. <I'm> <laughs> The Kraken. Sell the sizzle. Yeah, sell the sizzle. That might be right. uh, exactly who we want to parlay with is the Kraken. Oh. Mm. Okay. okay. Uh, make a uh, make a reaction check. A reaction check. 2D6. 2D6. Yep. Oh, and you can add, it you can add your charisma bonus. Hold on. Too. I'll roll over. It only rolled one. So let me roll two. Okay. Uh, and my charisma bonus is a whopping no bonus. It's 11, oh. so no bonus. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. All right. So 11. Six. 11. Well, that's not bad. That's, that's good. That's good. 11. That's uh -oh. good. For a dwarf, you want damn fine. Yeah. All right. So you hear them kind of whisper amongst themselves. You know, you're going to hear them talking about, well, what do you think? I mean, it sounds like they want a part of it. Is it the part of it? Yeah, I'll give it. Well, maybe. Okay. Yeah. It's like, very well, continue down the path towards the Kraken's lair. <laughs> I uh, look to Osric and George. Uh, well. Can we, can we see anything in the direction of voice, or are, are they still hidden? Uh, if you, you have to get, uh, roll six side dice, get a one. Maybe you'll see. Okay. Yeah. No. Oh, you're well hidden. So, you know, I, I am... Uh, um, yeah, uh, yeah. I'll certainly look. Mm -hmm. No. Right. No. Mm -hmm. They're well camouflaged in there. No. So, oh, I yeah. whisper, I whisper to Ongar, this must be... These must be the Fey. They can't be in league with the Kraken. Or it's, they, Oh, like, yes, or, or it is some of his lookouts. Could they be so well hid, do you think? Well, if they live out in these thickets and use them, they might know their way, uh, or know ways to camouflage themselves better than mm -hmm. a normal man. I, uh, I'll reach out and handle this thicket a little bit. Um, is it dry? Right. Or is it is it healthy? And or is the, it the thicket? Yeah, is it oh, yeah. dry? It's no, no. It's, it's um, green. like it would be. This isn't green. No, it's like wintertime thicket. You know, oh, okay. it's just a massive, okay. right? Tangled um, and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I look back okay. to my companions. You know, this might burn well. This thicket. Uh, well, yes, yeah. and we would with it. 
that would send us to our death, but... Uh, yes, you're right. It's, you're it's right. worth... I can't, you're right, I cannot uh, control it. Um, yes, so you think the Fae in, uh, is sending us... Uh, I don't know. I can't see them. And there's an elven thing back there by the mm -hmm. toadstool ring. I do not hey. know. My suspicion is that they have some arrangement, either with uh, the Fae or the Elves themselves. Otherwise, why would they let them dwell in these old woods with them? Yes, that, that is a seems, good point. Well, it is cool. the Kraken we are all here for, so I suppose we should move on. Oh, yes. Let's get Kraken and find this Kraken. <laughs> I, I was avoiding that. I purposely was avoiding that. <laughs> For the bard should say. Leave it to, I was going to okay. say, leave it to George the bard. <laughs> right, exactly, exactly. Okay, all right. So, yes, you continue. On down. guard, though. I've got my shield up now, my mace out. I'm definitely, yes. I'm yes. definitely I've on reloaded guard. my crossbow. <laughs> yes. All right, and let's see. Do we encounter anything else? Whoa! Okay. Oh, boy. Bye -bye. This is starting to look like the southern United States. We got the uh, Gulf there with Florida and Texas. <laughs> okay, what have we got? What have we got? Let's see here. Oh well, well you guys won't know what this is, anyways, because it's oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> the okay. dragon lives here. <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, so. Farther back on the trail that you just came in, you 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 hear a bellow, oh. and something is oh, like no. tearing into the thicket. Oh no! Yeah, the big boy has found us. <laughs> coming your coming your way. <laughs> All right. So uh, do we do we yeah. hear a panic up, up above us from where the voices were coming? Move faster, Unger. Uh, I have you a feeling we will move fast. We will not have to. We will not have to deal with those sentries again. I That's have right. a feeling. Yeah, I, uh, yeah. I, uh, there'll be a spring in my step as I hurry down the path now. Yes, and okay. George will follow. I've I've drawn my sword at this point, right, <laughs> and yeah. ready shield. Okay. So, yeah, you can hear this commotion and snapping of uh -oh. the thicket and, you know, uh, it's it's roaring and, and coming towards uh, where you are. And you guys are almost on the edge of another clearing. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll race okay. into that clearing for sure, uh, looking about uh, for another exit or for uh, a direction out. Yeah, that's... It's probably not that big, but oh well. Uh, yes, and there you can see another another opening, another exit over there. Okay. No oh. similar thicket to this? No, this isn't hidden. Oh. It isn't hidden. Okay. No. So it's an open clearing. There's no... It's open clearing. There's no boundary around it. Uh, no. No, no boundary. Uh, no, it's, it's, it's just it's a clearing. So, uh -oh, we're, so we're in the woods, so we can actually go in any enough. direction. Can't what? hear us. No. Can you no. hear us? Oh, okay. Yeah. I, I completely lost audio there for a second. Oh, okay. Yeah, you said right. it's not bound, and then what? No, no. It's it's a clearing, surrounded by thickets. Oh, okay. So we're still in okay. the thicket. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, and there's a there's a small cabin here. Oh, log cabin. Where in in the center? Yeah, in the center. Uh, it's not going to be there for much longer. And clearing, no. so there's nothing else to hide behind. Uh, uh there's a wood pile. Uh, there's there's maybe a little lean to barn of some sort. You can see uh, you can see old desiccated carcasses that have been strung up. But for a long time. Hmm. Mm. All right. Um, yeah, I'll look for the front door or window and head toward it uh, to to look in. Okay. All right. I'll run um, towards the wood pile, right, to like sort of hide behind, because I don't want to be. I want okay. something to block 
the Giants' view, but uh, right. Yeah. Okay, so it's a wood log lodge. The the windows are shrouded with a thick mat of overgrowth. Okay, and the door is kicked in already. Oh uh, well, I will uh, peek in while my friends, uh, well, why Osric uh, takes cover. I will look mm-hmm. in the door. All right, uh, you can see that there is a uh, a table uh, with uh, just some foodstuffs on it that have long since rotted, and uh, a, a bow hanging on the wall. Okay, I will grab with that a dusty bow. quiver. And, and you can see an old you can see an old corpse resting in the corner of the cabin on the ground. Okay. Half rotten leather pants. I'll make my way over to the corpse. Uh, I will grab the bow and the quiver on my way, and make my way over okay. to the corpse. And with my uh, mace, kind of poke it. Roll six side dice. All right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you can see that there is a s- silver uh, breastplate on this uh, individual. Hmm. All right. Yeah. I'll, but uh... as you po- as you poke it, that's when you notice, just as you poke it, that there's these roots coming out of its body. You can see its fingers of the corpse have have grown like roots into the ground. Okay. Its its foot bones have, have burst through its old leather boots and rooted into the ground long Ooh. ago. Damn. All right. Um so but you poked it. Okay. So <laughs> Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll uh, step nice away day, uh, from it. Uh, uh well Oh no, yeah, okay, yeah. okay. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hunger, oh, no, 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 no. like oh, no. the giant wasn't enough. You need more, you know. <laughs> okay, roll, roll versus uh, uh, bre- dragon breath. Okay, uh, hold on, let me double check my. Oh, I don't have them written down. My saves. Okay, I'll roll. I'm not certain what my saves are. We'll have to look that up. I can, I can look them up real okay. quick. Okay, uh, nine. Dwarf, I think right? I failed. I'm pretty sure nine. Nine. Failed. That smells like okay. yeah. So you 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 poke that the, that corpse. And it let out from its mouth. Spores uh, of some sort. Oh, oh no! Uh, I, uh, I, I wave them away with my mace hand. Uh, you know, as I as I try to back up away from this uh, corpse thing. Right. <clears throat> All right. Okay. So you're doing that. You're hacking and coughing, and you can hear the giant has made his way into the clearing. Okay. Uh, Where's George? (laughs) I'm I'm behind the wood pile. Where's George? uh, George is probably uh, just inside the doorway of the the shack. Yeah, watching you and then turns his attention to the sound of the the giant (laughs) bursting through the thicket into the opening. George is watching Unger in horror, right. and then turns around in even bigger horror. As the, as, you know. <laughs> right, 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 right. Okay, so you're at the wood pile. Yes. The other two are inside the the cabin. Is that yeah. true? That's right. Yes. Okay. All right. So let's see what draws his attention. Can he? I'm going to say, one, two, three, four, he's hearing the coughing coming from inside the cabin and is drawn to that sound. <laughs> and he sees George standing there in the doorway. <laughs> <laughs> Six. Okay. Oh. He doesn't. But he is drawn towards is the woodpile. really bad here? He <laughs> does. does. What? The wood pile? He's drawn towards the woodpile. <laughs> oh, no. He can see the glint of my armor. Right. Right. My helmet. That helmet. Must be giving it Dying away. in the sun, yes. <laughs> oh, no. All right, oh, no. so what are you going to do? He's 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 coming towards the wood pile. He's got a big club in his hand. Oh, Actually, no, he doesn't. He's just got his fists. He's just got his fists. All right. How far away is he from me? Um, 
Let's see. Let's go with... in giant in giant feet or in your feet. <laughs> my feet. Just <laughs> under just under forty feet. Oh wow! He's really... it's like what? Like three steps? For a <laughs> right. What step? Oh, he's twelve feet tall. He's twelve feet tall. <laughs> right. right? Yeah. yeah, but he's going to be on me like any moment now. Well. Uh, uh, you can roll can I, initiative. You can, yes, go ahead. Uh, I, I want to. Can I use my bardic lore to know if giants are Friendly? like you can be communicated with <laughs> and uh, like reasoned with, or if they're just like unintelligible? If they like brutes. banjo music. Okay. All right. <laughs> yeah. Make your make your lore check. Sure. I do not know. <laughs> you do not know. Okay. <laughs> I love that. Fail. George pulls out. The, uh, George pulls out Other the liar and goes. <laughs> 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 ding 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 ding. <laughs> okay. Uh, so we'll roll initiative there. Uh, I, okay. Yeah. Let's Isaac. let's do let's that. Ro let's uh, roll initiative. Let's see. Oh, Brandon, you get oh, 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 yeah. Gosh. Oh, no. <laughs> You're just oh, frozen yeah. stiff. I, yeah, I raised frozen. my shield. Oh, look, yeah, I the giant. I raised my shield and, and oh. sword right and stand behind it and, and, and look at it and say, uh, Be gone, giant. I will not be your meal. <laughs> and he comes crashing down towards you with his fist. Oh, God. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, coughing and there's a, choking. There's I say reason. to George, "What is that? What is happening out there, George?" As I splutter, it's, it's attacking Osric. I, be, I believe. There's a it. reason. There's a reason I've been mentioning my cousin Leoric for a while. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You might have noticed. Yes. <laughs> Here we go. Ten. No. Okay. No. Well, okay, that's not that's, that's not bad. That, there goes the wood pile. Game. The wood pile explodes wow. into. You know, yeah, it Wood. explodes. <laughs> yep, all over the place. Uh, make a deck save. We'll see whether you you go you go ass over tea kettle. <laughs> oh with no! With the rest of the logs. Nice. Of the logs. So this is uh, under your decks. Under decks. Okay, so under I got decks. a fourteen. Yep. So 14. nice. Look at that. 13? Okay, there you go. All right. You're, you're able to keep your footing. So. Now, we'll let the other two. Uh, we'll. Yeah, I'm, I'm headed for the door, coughing and spluttering. Oh, actually, you should get. You should get. A, you should get an attack. As okay. I. Uh, oh yeah, right, right, Osric. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, it's a have at the beast, and I tried to hit it. Uh, uh, help me out, because this is OSE, and I haven't played it in a while. Yeah. I got a plus one. Yep. To hit, and yep. I add my strength to that. Correct. Right. Yep. Yep. Okay. Cool. 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 So it's plus two. Uh, nice. Cool. Yes. Now you made it angry. Uh oh. <laughs> and my sword is one d eight. I forgot to add the uh, damages on it. Long sword is what one d eight, right? Yes. I believe. Yeah. Two plus your strength. Uh, three, three because of strength. Three. Okay, three. three. Yes, oh. my mighty three hit points of damage. Three. Okay. I have right. almost slain the giant. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's go to the next round, and we'll roll initiative. Uh, one of you for the group, and I'll roll for the giant. Uh, I'll let Eloy roll since he's in it. Uh, I'm coughing yeah. and spluttering, headed outside to get fresh air. Oh. Oh. T two? Okay. You rolled two? Yes. Two. Oh. Yes. Right. Okay, tie goes to you. Yeah. Ooh. So... Um. You can uh, declare what you want to do, I guess. We should have done that before. I keep forgetting that. Um, all right. So, who's going to go? You guys decide. Uh, uh, you're right there. Eloy, you should probably decide what Oscar's going to do. Yeah. <laughs> Since you're in the heat of it. Stay back! <laughs> I will slay you, giant! <laughs> So I'll, I'll, I guess I'll swing at it again because I don't think I can intimidate this thing. Uh -uh. Oh well, you know I just wounded you know, it. I, you just I, wounded it. You're right. I, I'm so. gonna try. I'm gonna try to intimidate yeah. it, right? Maybe, so yeah. I raise my sword and I sort of, you know, uh, 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 f like faint forward, you know, holding mm -hmm. my action to see if it reacts to to what I do, right? Mm -hmm. Holding my my sword until I can. Okay. Try again. Uh, I'll make a reaction check to this, but. Uh... 
I'm going to put a minus two on it, okay? Right, sure. Okay. That's fair. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. bigger okay. than me, so it so, seems fine. Minus two off of this is six, that's four. So, yeah. Very hostile. <laughs> Very hostile. Very hostile. <laughs> All right. Okay, uh, you other two, what are you doing? Uh, I come stumbling out, shield and mace in hand, uh, and uh, coughing and spluttering. I'll look up to see this giant facing something uh, where the wood pile used to be. Yeah. Um, and I will. Uh, uh, charge in with my mace, striking it on the Achilles, hopefully, or the or the calf or something, if I can. Okay. Okay. And, and Osric, of course, is going uh, before me, I'm sure, right? Oh. He already went, right? Oh, he, didn't, oh, he didn't attack? Oh, okay. No, I, I tried to intimidate oh, him. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. And I got a plus one as well, so yeah. five. <laughs> five. Yeah, thanks for coming out. Yeah. All right. You're coughing. You start coughing. Yeah, exactly. I'm coughing. Oh, no. I'm coughing and hacking the whole time. Oh, no. Oh, no. And you missed okay. a huge Ooh. Achilles heel, right? George. <laughs> mm -hmm. George, George feels now feels obligated to assist because these, <laughs> these two people are probably in over their heads. <laughs> so uh, he, he lifts his crossbow. And just peeks out of the door enough to uh, to take aim and fire. Nice. Okay. And he and rolls a, a fourteen. Nice. That's Any sense. pluses? Uh, that's that's that incorporated. Yes, that incorporated my bonus. Okay. okay. Right. Just goes whizzing by his ear. Oh God. Oh. Okay, so I guess it's his turn. Yeah. Ung Ungar, coughing and spluttering, says to Osric, did you have to pick a fight with the giant? All right. Now, did we're, we're going to roll, see who he goes after, because all, all of you have... Engaged. Engaged, mm -hmm. and that arrow just came by his ear, so he's, he's aware someone's behind him. Okay, so... Um... um Ungar is one two, Osric is uh, three four, and George is five six. Two. Ungar. Ungar. Oh Ungar. no. Yeah, he, he can't help but hear me coughing and spluttering. Right. Yeah, yeah. And you're okay. by, just by his foot, right? Right. So. Exactly. I'm a threat. <laughs> okay. Here, here it comes. Oh no. Well, oh, that's not too. That's not. But is that a hit? Uh, I think I have a bonus against giants, don't I? I do. You just might sure. actually. Yeah. Dwarves. I, I don't have the book that I, has dwarves in it. Hold on. But hold on. I'll tell you. Either an like AC bonus two. or a hit bonus, something like that. <laughs> I don't see anything about. I don't see anything about it. God OSC that sucks. Might just, that might just be gnomes and halflings. Oh, no, uh, wrong edition. OSC sucks. <laughs> Why oh, don't no. we play an OSC? <laughs> 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 All right, so it doesn't hit you though. Okay, uh, as it swings, I dodge deftly, coughing and spluttering, mm -hmm. looking at Os Osric uh, again, uh, trying to de determine what kind of person I have uh, attached. Uh, that I have engaged as a partner in this journey, that he would attack a giant. Um, and then I will swing uh, with my mace at its big toe. Okay. Ah, plus oh, one nine. No. Oh, okay. Well. But I will take advantage of him being distracted. Yes. And I hit it! Nice. Yes. Nice. Oh! For nice. nine points of damage! Nice. Oh, wow. it's, it's mad missing. now. It's mad now. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Well, you got its attention. Awesome. Okay. Let's roll initiative. Ooh, ooh. George, does George, George, wait, George has to go? Does George... Oh, George has um, to go. I'm sorry. Uh, I go last. Cause oh, that's right. You're a crossbow. Reloading. That's right. Uh, reload so that crossbow, that mean... man. Yeah. I think... Did, did the giant go? It, I think it went first. Gonna... Yeah, it tried, it tried to hit wait. me already. Yeah, we might have got a little out of order there because it was a tie for initiative last round. So you guys went first. It okay. needs to go, right? Okay. Yes. But 
So I got a little lost there. Wait a minute. But it just right. it just missed. It just, yes. just missed. Yes, it just missed. Yes. That's right. Okay, so let's just roll initiative. Okay. Yeah, I rolled a one for okay. initiative. So. You rolled a one for the group. Yeah, unfortunately. <clears throat> oh, oh my gosh! There you go. Oh my gosh! <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. So what are we doing? Uh, I'm now aiming for his little toe. <laughs> <laughs> Bam! No, oh my this giant no. is. I can just see this giant is like picking his foot up, right, and avoiding my yeah. mace. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Stop bugging me! Stop bugging me! Yeah. All right. <laughs> Who's next? Uh, it has to be you. Yeah. Or uh, Oscar, he's going to be next. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm, right, I'm right there, so might as well. Have at oh, me! Oh, whoa! Seven, wow. Eighteen. Nice. Oh, it again. Oh, okay. Damn. Seven Ow. points of damage. Damn. Oh wow! He may slay oh, a dra- He may slay a giant. Be gone, a a giant slayer. <laughs> Damn. Be that's gone, that's oh, nineteen beast. points of damage so far that you've put on. Okay. Him. Well, I'm gonna roll morale. That's sweet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Osric the well, giant over the, slayer. Over the over the number he leaves. He flees. He flees. Yes, we want to, we want to yes. roll high. It's good for us. High. Yes. Oh, See you. there we go. Wow. Yes. Yes. Hot <laughs> yes. damn! Holy cow! Can I yes. can I fire the crossbow one more time before yes. it disappears? And sure, perfect. sure you can. All right. Yep. <laughs> wow. Just for good morale, just for good measure. Wow. All right. Here we go. Uh... Come on. Hit it. That's yes. Oh, yeah. yes. I rolled a 20. Plus two. <laughs> nice. Oh, wow. Insult to injury. <laughs> okay, okay. we're going bolt in his back for good measure. Uh, wow. Actually, I'm pretty. Let me double check. I'm pretty sure it's a D8. Is that right? A crossbow? Yeah. Uh, oh, no, it's D6. D6, yeah. Nice. Four. Four points of damage. Not too shabby. Wow, that's twenty-three shabby. points that you guys put on him. Oh, yeah. And don't come back. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. Wait, till, wait till cousin Lewarik hears about this yeah. back in Erlen. Yeah. <laughs> okay, he so he takes. Giant. <laughs> he takes off uh, back down that path. Right. Nice. Uh, I look at I look at Osric. Wow. Uh, you, you, you do not. Uh, uh, you do not disappoint, Osric. I have I have chosen well, a grand companion, and I'll uh, turn and pat uh, George on the back. Did you see that man? Oh, that that was incredible fighting. I think uh, I may be willing to give you your uh, the bounty on the Kraken if we can if we can capture him. Yes, uh, you certainly be, earned it. There may be a song about this. Uh, 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 Minstrel? <clears throat> wow. I, I will certainly, certainly give a thought as I go to sleep tonight. <laughs> we, All right. we vanquished a giant. <laughs> wow. Well, we, okay. we drove it off. Don't... Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> well, I'll exaggerate in the song. We close, don't need to do close, it right now. close enough, Minstrel. Close We're enough. alive. Okay. <laughs> So I uh, I explained to them what's in the cabin. Of course, George has seen it, but I'll tell Osric uh, there is uh, there is fine silver breastplate in there, but is attached to a spore spewing plant of some kind, which unfortunately I have inhaled as I cough and splutter. Hmm. But does, a silver breastplate uh, might well be worth the risk. Does Ungar look like sickly? Like he's Normally, like yes. infected with something. No. Yeah, normally he looks sick. <laughs> Even more so. <laughs> no, no, no. I don't know. I mistrust this fairy magic. No. Nope. Well, you know, the nice thing about silver is it doesn't burn, but cabins yes. do. <laughs> uh, I agree, That's... and uh, I will. Right. Uh, I'll fish my oil out of my pack, uh, smiling at George. As I do, uh, get out mm-hmm. my uh, flint and tinder and start trying to spark a torch, a light, uh, smiling at my companions as I do. I would like to, nothing more than to see that damn thing burn after it 
spit its Aubrey. spores on me. Very well. Um, okay. Yeah, so in a short time, you have the cabin aflame. Okay. So I'm going to get my sending oil off here. Smoke. What's that? Uh, nothing. I was just going to make a note that I've used my oil. Yes. Okay. Yeah. And any rations you've used, too, uh, since you left uh, brick at bottom. Okay. All right. Okay, yeah. So now this, this smoke is billowing into the sky. And You're sure that won't draw any attention? <laughs> oh, it surely will. Well, but I what wonder to, what happened can... to those lookouts. I'm sure right. that they uh, they soiled their pants and ran when they saw that <laughs> giant you drove off. Right. Oh, nice and warm here around the fire yes. cabin. You know, are you, you're waiting for it to totally burn down to? to well, I mean, yeah. we're gonna we're gonna have to come back once. <laughs> it's gonna take quite some time for this cabin to uh, to fully yeah, burn good, and yes. for it to be navigable in the embers. Yeah, so we, so mm -hmm. Osric takes a little rest, having, uh, you know, fought with a giant and eats some of the rations and drinks some of the wine. Yes, yes, but, you uh, need to do that. You know, the Mistral is right. Uh, the smoke will show for miles. And all the ruckus with the giant certainly mm -hmm. has alerted the Kraken. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so, do you entrance. want to? Do you want to continue... Down that path? Oh yeah, I mean, or, I'll, 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 or I'll move back. With, I agree with George. We can come back when it's burned down and, and root through the rubble for the shield or for whatever it is, breastplate. Right. Let's continue so, down the path. Yes. Okay. Down the path. All right. <clears throat> that is a path. It's not the thicket that's, thing anymore, that's, right? That is the path. Is is this is the path going? Yes. Yep. Right. So it's just a normal path. It's just a normal path. It's not this thicket tunnel. Oh, okay. okay. So we came right. out of the thicket and found a cabin. Yeah. I gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. Right. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So you'll continue down. God, you guys were lucky no one got hit. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> 2d8 damage. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah. Average damage is death for like yes. any of us. So. <laughs> okay. All right. So, continuing on your way. Do we see footsteps or anything in this in, in this area? So, yeah. You it, would it indicate yeah. someone went out yeah. uh, ahead yeah. of us? Yeah, someone went ahead of you. Definitely. Okay. Mm, okay. Yeah. Okay. And continuing? Yes. Yes. Uh, yeah. I think at some point we should get off the path as we did before and parallel its course. Agreed. Yeah, so we'll uh, we'll parallel it from uh I don't know, a few feet. Okay. Yeah, 20, 20 feet 20 as feet, before yeah. or something. Yeah. So we can hide in in the woods, right? If somebody mm -hmm. comes. 20 feet. Hear somebody running. Okay. Yeah. At 20 feet you can still see the path. Right. Right. Okay. And she curls again. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And you can see another clearing uh, coming up. Okay. All right. So, and you can also hear some activity. Uh, voices. Like voices a large group? Or what? like a large group? Uh, sounds like more, than, more than half a dozen. Okay. Right. Hmm. Half a dozen. Perhaps we should approach quietly and see if we can... Mm -hmm. And you're north. not on the path. You're not no, on no, the path, we're right. right. No, right. we're okay. uh, we're twenty. Are you feet from to the it. east of the path or the west of the path? I would think uh, east. Yeah. I don't know though, guys. What, what yeah. side are we on? Now, in, in my mind, uh, we were going south on, on that portion. Right? Oh, right. So, so we're so we would be yeah. east of the path. So we would yeah. be on the east of the yeah. path. Mm -hmm. yes. Yeah. Okay. 
Yeah, and uh, in this area, uh, you can see there's yeah at least a half a dozen. There might be ten hmm. uh, men kind of gathering and arming themselves. They've got you know like a barrel with swords in it, oh. right? And some of them are grabbing bow and arrows. Okay, and they're they're motioning towards your direction. Or towards the direction of the path, I should say. Oh, okay. right. Okay. All right. Uh, do we do we spy a, a, a tentacled Correct. armed man among them? Uh, roll six sided dice. Um, let's say got a good chance if there's somebody there, like that. I nope. 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 Five five four. <laughs> <laughs> now. Yeah. No, I, I'm I'm not even complaining anymore, man. Yeah. We we survived a giant. Yeah, so I know. Like, I mean, are you kidding fine. me? Right, we, it's I, fine. We can die yeah. happily ever after now. <laughs> yes, it's fine. Yeah. We had an epic moment. <laughs> I wasn't in Joff. Trust me, that's epic. Oh yes, yes. Oh. Yeah, we're probably we're probably gonna die by bandit. I now, mean, I had after surviving I had, a giant. My first so, character you know. died on the in the first five minutes with the spider falling on my head. So. <laughs> <laughs> Good times, good times. Yeah. <laughs> and Elroy, right. in his first adventures in Job, runs a damn giant off. <laughs> it's unbelievable. <laughs> I've only yeah. been playing four years and haven't won a combat yeah. yet. <laughs> yeah. I, I would say beginner slug, but I think I've been playing this game at least as long as you, That's all right. of you have. So, That's, you right. know. That's awesome. <laughs> that is awesome. All right, so you can see a collection of tents here and like a fire in the middle of the tents, right? Mm -hmm. But... Yeah, like maybe five of these these individuals are moving towards the path. Mm -hmm. The other other five are standing back with their their missile weapons. Okay, so so either they have heard us or they or they think they can we see the smoke above all of the trees and everything. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to crouch Hello. down and you know quietly and uh, wait and see where they go. Since we're twenty feet off, I'd rather I'd rather deal with five than ten. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. Mm -hmm. So let's see if uh, if that group spots you in the brush. And, and there's tents and stuff in the clearing. Yeah, there's that, there's a yeah, yeah. couple of tents. It's a camp. Size tent. okay. It's a camp. Yeah. 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 Okay. No. So they don't see you. And oh, nice. they head off down the trail. Okay. Towards the smoke. And can we, um, as we watch the, uh, you, so wait, all of them go or just some of them? No. Five. Five yeah. with swords. Five. Okay, that's what I thought. And five are okay, so, behind with missile weapons. Yes. And none of them as, is a Kraken, as far as we can tell. Well, as as so tell. what I was going to say is as they walk by with swords, do we see a free hand with all of, with those five people with swords? Because, I mean, I assume they'd be carrying them in one hand and we should see a free hand with the... Uh... Tentacle? Well, is that what you're asking um, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to count free hands to oh, see right, if... Right, right, right. Three hands. hands. If there's, there should be yes. ten hands. If there's, if there's oh, five men, oh, there should be ten hands. Yes. Oh, okay. Five of them are holding swords. Okay. Okay. The other. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. So you do see that one of them has something strange hanging out of his cloak. Okay. okay. One of the ones who passed us by. Right. Yeah. Oh. Yep. Yep. Okay. So we could parallel them and ambush them we here once they get far enough down back. the trail. Yes. Yes. So what are you going to do? Yeah, yeah I think we should move. parallel them and ambush them once they get uh, oh, far enough away from this uh, missile group. Yes. Okay. So we find the here. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, and probably we all have bows now. I found a bow and quiver. Yeah. So we all can right. all launch missiles at them before we. Uh, uh huh. 
Uh-huh. What are the range penalties here again? If somebody can remind me, zero minus two minus four or I, something. I'm not sure. Uh, I, don't I have know. to look at that. Hold on. I think I it's actually. Point I think blank it's plus, plus one, one for short yeah. range. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Plus one, zero, and negative one. That's it's it. Yeah. Good. That's it. Okay. All right. So let's see if uh, uh, actually. Let's see there. They are surprised. Wow, nice. Okay. Sure rolled that up front, but okay, so yes, they are blissfully unaware of you. They are more focused on the smoke billowing up from the other cabin. So I think we should take advantage of this. Do it. Uh how far away are they? Let's see, they will be Oh, okay. That's about 20 yards. Okay. 20 All yards right. is about 60 feet, so yep. it's at zero for me. Okay, yeah. yep. So take okay. aim and fire. I'm going to fire at, I... I'm gonna fire at everybody but Kraken. So I, I don't want to shoot at the Kraken. I'll shoot at somebody else. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we, we should probably each shoot at separate people. Mm-hmm. Do you think that's... Yeah. There's five, sure. All All right. It's a good chance right. we can yes. kill at least one. All right, so I'll pick one target, There's and mine. I got a plus and two. And I miss. Plus two. Yes, okay. What's, 16 what's plus new? 2 is 18. <laughs> what's new? <laughs> All right, hold on. I'm sorry. Hold on one second. Short I closed my character be, sheet. Short bow should be 1d6. Oh. Yes. Okay, 16? Yes. Wow. Was cool. hit, oh. hit, hit, hit. Roll your damage. Damn. Oh! Uh, Take him down. One guy down. Oh my gosh, Eloy's killing it. That's four. amazing. Four damage. Do do we add? Do no, we don't no, add dexterity or anything, no, right? There's, there's no, no bonus. No. In this right. Yeah. Wrong addition. Yes. So four <laughs> points of damage to one yeah, guy. There's only five hundred and six OSRs out there. So exactly. <laughs> Plus I had to pick the one without the dex bonus. Yeah, right. Yes. It's like twelve <laughs> editions of D and D or yeah, something. Right, yeah. Right, right. All right, who's, who's and I missed. I missed with a nine. Oh, okay. Uh, yes, you did. All right, and Ungar. Oh, you missed. I missed. Two. I missed with a five. Okay, so we said they are twenty yards away. Yes, sixty feet. So, so did I kill mine or just you killed yours? Oh yeah, one yes. shot. One shot. Yes. All right. Okay. So, um, so they're aware now of where the shots are coming from, and they're going to try and take cover. So we'll we'll add another two to the armor class. Okay. Right. Uh, well, I'm going into okay. melee and charging them. So. But that was a surprise round. Do we? Yes, it was. So whatever. Yeah. Now we're in, yes, we're initiative. Yes. And uh, yeah. yes, so you. my declaration is I'm going into melee and charging them before we roll. So okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna lob another arrow at one of them because I see them scattering to the. Okay. To the thing. Do I roll in initiative? George? Yep. Yeah, we're gonna roll. Oh, you're rolling it? Six okay. initiative, yes! All nice. Right. We'll take Two, it. okay. Yeah. Put an arrow That's in him. Finish right. another one. Ah, uh, no. No. Has got to run at some point. Uh, I go, okay. I go uh, scrambling through the uh, nine inches of snow, bellowing <laughs> and swinging my mace, shield in front, and three. <laughs> she many Christmas. This is not dwarf country, this for sure. Oh, my God. <laughs> God. Okay, John. I, mean, I haven't had a roll over ten. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going. To, I'm going to fire my crossbow again, but I'll have to wait till they go first. Till they go. All right. So there's uh, four of them left, and they're moving towards you. So we'll we'll say that we we meet in the middle as you're as you're loading your crossbow. Let's see what happens here. So four of them. Okay, one. Okay, so. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, so, Jason, you are one, two, and uh, three, four is Eloy, and five, six is one. Okay, so one comes running out towards you with his short sword, screaming. Right? Makes sense, because... Yeah, I engaged him. I engaged somebody, so they should. And... Uh, Deflect it with my shield. Okay. Yes. That's one. Two, second one attacks you also. 
Yeah, of course. I'm right there. I'm yeah. in melee with him. Okay. Makes sense. And swings and 13. Nope. I've got 15. Nope. Woo-hoo-hoo. Deflected okay, away. That's two. The third one attacks George. Races past me to George. Yeah, as he's trying to load his crossbow. Oh, no. Oh, no. Maybe, maybe, maybe he'll miss and you'll get that shot off just before he gets to you. <laughs> like a shot. Two, he misses. Yeah, like a shot okay. in the face. <laughs> Crossbow yeah, like in the face. Tripped on the way. <laughs> it looks like he might have. And the last one is a taller gent. And he's going at George as well. Oh, wow. And he's got he's got a a, a a long sword. No, I'm sorry, it's a hammer. It's a hammer. Uh, and he's swinging it, but you can also see that it, one of his his other arm is a tentacle. Oh God, you're fighting All right? the Kraken. <laughs> Okay, so he is attacking you, George, and he swings with his sword. Three! Nice. And yes. misses. Unfortunately, George is a level 17 bard. Yes, so, you put, know, that, he put, that, put that. So you, will be able to, you will be able to get your shot off. Nice. All right. I'm going Point to fire plus one. the not, yeah, the one that is not the Kraken. Mm-hmm. Uh, and sorry, I accidentally clicked off of <laughs> roll 20. I had to reload. Uh, so I'll get a plus one. Nice. I got oh, a 23. Yeah. How does that have another wow. 20? Wow. Yeah, that's brilliant. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, he did oh. one point of damage. Oh. Point blank, well, but like... it grazes his cheek. Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay, that's that's great. I can All imagine right. George sc- screaming a little bit when two guys with oh. swords come at him. <laughs> All right, so that's the scream. last of that round, right? Yes. So, yep. Okay, roll this again. Right. Two for two for bandits. Uh, do I roll? Yeah, sure. sure. You, you got you got the juice. There it is, yeah, man. There we go. There we go. Juice there we go. Tonight. All right. So I will I will Chaos. drop my yeah. bow and draw sword and ready shield. Mm-hmm. And once I do that, I'll rush to aid George. Okay. Because he's got right. the Kraken, so I'm figuring, mm-hmm. you know. Mm-hmm. I'm going to drop the crossbow and draw my sword. Okay. And I attempt sque- to impale this one whose cheek I grazed. Perfectly. I uh, I scr- <laughs> uh, as I deflect these two blows, I scream back, and with my mace, lunge out at one. That's on me. And oh, cry many, cry many, cry many. Oh. <laughs> Elmo's rolling nineteens right. and sixteens. Wow. And 16s. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm rolling ones and threes. What the hell? It okay. That's awesome. It's it awesome. That's what so I love here we about go. gaming, right? Uh. Mm-hmm. One attacks. Uh, well, we didn't wait. Wait, wait. wait what? what? Eloy and I didn't do our attacks. We were just describing. Is that our action? Is is drawing oh, blows oh, okay. and drawing right, swords right. our action? No, I don't my know. My mistake. My mistake. Yeah. Yeah, because you were you were drawing your swords and moving, right? Right. So, oh, so is that yes. our action? Yeah. Okay. So action. Sorry. Cool. Okay. So we don't get to attack this round, is what you're saying. No, no, you draw your sword and you move oh. and you attack. Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, I move right. and I attack. Okay, kill, cool. Kill cool. somebody. Yeah, yeah. Kill him, kill him. So, so I'm going to hit... You know what? George, try and see if you can hit one guy and I'll I'll, I'll, I'll decide who to okay, attack. Well, one, the, okay, I'm going to attack the one that, whose cheek I grazed. <laughs> my crossbow. <laughs> oh, nice. 18. Whoa. Yes. There we go. Okay. Great. Now for some real damage. Come on. Yes. Oh, nice. Oh, yes. You, <laughs> you drop them. Holy cow. Right. Nice. Yeah, so, so okay. after I I created this beautiful wound on his cheek <laughs> that he would be proud of, uh, I run through and put my left hand on his shoulder, his right shoulder, as I pull him towards me and impale him in the gut. Right, right. Nice. My sword. And nice. he drops to the ground, and then I look straight dead-eye with the Kraken and Smirk. Yeah. 
I can imagine the guy uh, when you graze him says, "You missed," and then you go, "No, I didn't," and drive it through. <laughs> okay, so right. so I lunge at him with my yes. sword, but the cracking, I guess, sidesteps or beats it aside with his tentacle. Right, right, <laughs> yep. Yeah. All right, and we got. Got uh, three three guys left. Okay, so the one of the one of the bandits attacks George. Eight. Hang on, oh, we have to roll initiative. Wait a minute, we have to roll initiative, don't we? No, uh, no, 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 no. Right. There's, there's, yep. There was the Kraken and a bandit with George, and George killed the bandit. So it's only the Kraken there with the two of us, and the other two are uh, on Ungar. Yeah. Okay, two yes. rounds. Okay. But you haven't done any attacks this round. That's your first one. Right. Right. Okay, so. But that's attacking George. Okay. Okay. Right? And he missed. Yes. Yes. That's correct. Okay. Uh, and we'll do the two that are on Unger, okay? Right. Oh, oh, oh no, 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 no. <laughs> 20. Did you roll two 20s? Take, no. no. Just one. Oh. Just one. Okay, so you take four points damage. Okay. Oh, you uh -huh. hear uh, you exactly. hear Unger cry out, but he's still on his feet. But you can see he's oh. been wounded out of the corner of your eye. Okay. Let's see. Does this next one attack Unger, or does he turn his attention on somebody else? Ooh. I think they're done, right? There were two. No, there was. And, and the I haven't done the cracking. Yet. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Yeah. yeah, and I haven't done the second one that was on Unger. No, no. They, they, oh, now, there's only there's only three left, right? Yeah. No, and the dragon uh, attacked George and he missed. Yeah, there's yeah, one so more on me. Left. There's still one more on me. There's one more. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Let's see what happens. Oh, yeah, good. Nice. Okay. <laughs> All right. So he rolls. All okay. Right. Now we roll initiative again. Yes. Uh, Kraken didn't. Oh go. no! Yes, Kraken <laughs> went and missed <laughs> okay, George. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting so yeah, confused. The Kraken, the Kraken missed George. Three. Okay. But I'm extremely concerned, so I am paying attention to the Kraken. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Now the Kraken can do his. Now stuff. the Kraken's going to attack. <laughs> Either George or me. George. Oh no. George. George, you've drawn his ire. Yes, you have. Slaying his face. Oh, oh 18, 19. That is, yes, That's that is hit. enough to hit me. Uh, big one. Short big sword. one. Big one. Big one. D8, eh? Whoa. Boom. Oh. All right. That, that uh, takes a big chunk out of me. Does it? <laughs> I got four hit points left. Oh, oh no. What okay. level are you, George? Three. Two. Oh, two. 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 Yeah. He's good. And he hasn't taken any damage yet. No, he is the not. The Kraken? No. No. Okay. So there's the two Kraken? guys on the Vongar, right? Yep. Yeah, and I'm going right. to I'm gonna try right now to finally get one here. No, okay. I don't think so. Plus one, I got 12. 12 hits? Oh, it does. Hot diggity. Yeah. And uh, Mace is 1d6. Plus one strength, two. Oh, two. Oh, Was this the one you hit all it's before? One, uh, yes. Did I hit anybody? Okay. Did I ever hit anyone? I don't know I, if I, I have. I thought you had. You had two points against him. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Okay. Early. So that guy is down. Nice. Yes. Nice. All right. So that leaves. I got to make a morale check. Got to make a morale check. Okay. So here we go. Magic number is over seven. Boom. Seven. Over seven. Wait, over seven or seven? Oh, and over seven. seven. Over, over seven. seven. <laughs> over seven. <laughs> yes. All right, so they're not giving up. <clears throat> so it's our turn to attack? Yeah, uh, we roll initiative uh, now. No, we don't uh, no, roll initiative now. Okay, no, we, we lost initiative in this round. Oh, no. oh yeah, yeah right. you did. Right. You did. Right. Okay, I'm getting so confused. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so go ahead. Kraken, that's Whoa. a 16. 16 to hit. Oh, against two, the crack? Yeah. Yes. Oh, nice. That hits. Two Three points. points of damage Three to the Kraken. Okay. All right. Um, <laughs> are you yours. using deadly force or are you. Uh, no, we want to take duel. him captive, don't we? Mm, that's true. We want him captive. So I'll try and smack him with a flat of the sword. Okay. All right. Yeah. And. Uh, 
Who's next? Where are we? Um, it would be George. Uh, I killed, yeah, George. I George will say, <clears throat> "You've betrayed Hilda. She rots in a cage." And I will attack him again with, or I'll, I, actually, I'm attacking him for the first time mm -hmm. uh, with the flat of my sword as well. Ah. Oh. <laughs> All right. Okay. Is it my? Is it? Uh, yes, it's yours. It's my turn. Okay. Uh, attack the last one on me. Okay. Uh, missed. Dang it. Oh. All right. So now All right. initiative. Initiative. Here we go. Two. Ooh. All right. Ooh, oh, we're tied, so it right. goes to us. Mm-hmm. Ongar. Do I it. Will, Do it, will, man. I Come will on. Kill it. <laughs> Uh, plus one, oh, eleven. Plus one. Uh, no. Okay. No. Okay. Who's next? George. George. All right. Take down your um. beloved uh, <laughs> ransom, I guess. All right. Here we go. Mm. No. no. He's definitely uh, smacking oh, away. I, I wasted blows. all my good rolls. Oh, yeah. look at that boy. Oh, 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 God almighty. Another 20. I oh. smack him for six points. Ooh. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. With the hilt of the sword, right? It's like I reverse, I reverse the grip, right? Yes. That's what the, yes. the yes. Uh, Western martial arts do. Okay, well, yeah. he's, he's, start, he's starting to look a little wobbly. All right. Yes. Okay, that's... Yield! Uh, that, Stand down. Let's see. Let's see. Who's left? There's just him and one other guy. Yeah, one on me. Yes. And, and okay. Back. All right. So one against you. Two misses. Ooh. And the Kraken. Well, now. you rolled a. Uh, you rolled a d6. Oh, you only rolled a d6. <laughs> oh, did I roll? <laughs> That's all right. As Dang long as. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. I'll take a look. Gosh. Okay. All right. Okay. Um. Okay. So that was one of them that. Now the Kraken. Yeah, does it? Nope. Nope. Okay, now it's the Kraken. Who's, Who's the, the Kraken, Kraken hitting? Me, he attacking. I'm kicking his ass. George. George, oh, he hates George. He hates George. George invoked Hilda. George's got four hit points left. Let's see what happens. <laughs> oh, no. Swings and no. misses. Woo. All right, here we go. Initiative. Initiative. I got it this time. There it is. Uh, five, oh. for us. five for me. <laughs> right. All right, Ungar. Ungar, man. Ungar, after blocking that last blow, says, I have had it. Die, you fool. Shut <laughs> up. <laughs> no. No. I no. Down, Kraken. Down. Oh, that, Plus that, two is 16. That, that hits. Uh-oh. Kraken's going to have to yield. Yes. Oh, my no. God. Nine points. Damn. Nine points. <laughs> Never even got to use his tentacle. And yeah. he <laughs> falls to the ground. And when that happens, uh, this this other guy, I don't think he's going to have much fight in him. He's going to he's going to surrender. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> this leader just got and I uh, knocked out with my mace. I bat his sword away out of his hand. Yes, kneel before us, you 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 bandit, you <laughs> bandit. <laughs> We can, uh, I, right. I start. I start tying up uh, yeah. the kraken. Um, mm -hmm. I guess when I get to when I get when I get to his tentacle, uh, <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm, I have to think about this for a second. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, let's uh, use my. I've got I consider 50... I consider nodding his tentacle around his arm yeah. uh, and several other options. Well, and, I've got I've uh, got fifty feet of rope. We could literally coil yeah, it around his whole torso <laughs> and arms, right? Bunch uh, of times, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, all right, let's do it. Yeah, we got fifty feet of rope, so we'll just coil it around him and around him and around him and around his tentacle, tied to his torso. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. We'll coil the right tightly um, around. Did I ever show you a picture of the Kraken? I don't know if we got a picture. Yeah, we do have pictures. Uh, I've yeah. seen him. I've seen him before. Yeah. Uh, Gentlemen, where? Oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. See him? No. Uh, can't see him. Show the players. Oh, there, oh, there, there he is. is. Yeah. Now there he is. Nice. Look at yeah. the Yeah. Nice. <laughs> and. <laughs> What's this, the story behind the Kraken? I think John wasn't it your character or was it David's character? 
because he was like a, a scout for you guys. Oh, yes. Uh, way back. Oh, and one of you pushed him down when you were being chased by the fairies. <laughs> right? Yes. And that they was turned like his thief, I think. Yeah, yeah. And, yeah. They, and, and uh, they cursed him. They cursed him with a, a tentacle arm, which he didn't yeah. have much control of at the beginning, but he got a little better with it as time went by. Uh, yeah, okay. So you, great, you tie him up. super villain origin story. Then he, get, then he oh, yeah. became a bandit. Right. Yeah, that's right. Joe, All right. I, I say we must flee. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, we must. It, was, it, it would have been nice if we could have taken that silver breastplate of yours, but there's still more bandits back there, no, and we, we don't know if the elven. I am bad. I am badly turn. wounded, uh, so we'll make sure we tie up the uh, the other bandit we have now. So we have two prisoners. Okay, and uh, yes. yeah, let's uh, lead us toward this long fang camp, uh, George. I okay. I say we t this other prisoner. Uh, we we pay him five gold to lead us out safely onto the main road, and then we I, we can let him go. As far as I'm concerned, I'm only concerned about this one. Yes, we have no. There's no bounty to be collected on your head, bandit. You okay. lead us true. We'll make some profit out of this, and who knows? Perhaps you become leader of your. Of your band, we have no care for you. All right, so he will take you back down to. Actually, let's let's see if he's going to accept your offer. He's just going <laughs> to. Gonna... Hi, is good. I have a plus one charisma. If okay. <laughs> eight. Seven. Eight. Okay. All right. So he'll he'll lean towards agreeing with you, but he's he's not making it easy for you. All right. Uh, he's not wholeheartedly into it. But you know he's like he gets you down to the the corner here yeah. by the mushrooms, and he's like, yeah, "Take that path down there; you'll find your mm. way out." Mm. All right. Oh, you! Uh, I'll give you ten if you lead the way. Oh, okay. Well, let's see. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> forget that. All right, so. <clears throat> There is a trail. Goes well, I'll down. take. Uh, I did get some of this twine and rope from the uh, the bone scarecrow, mm -hmm. and I'll tie his feet and his hands up and leave him here in the snow so he can at least buys us time. Oh, the bandit. Yeah. yeah. So so at least uh, he it buys us time to get away. Right. right. Okay. We gag him. We so gag him. where? Yeah. Scream. Where are we? We're here. That's yeah. Okay. We're, we're headed for the long uh, thing since... direction. Right, and uh, it's I'm of... actually. Uh, hold on one second. Uh, rather than leaving him here, this is where the wild oh. elf back was, right? Yes. Yes. Uh oh. Uh, okay. I'm going to throw him into the circle of mushrooms. Okay. Uh, oh. against... <laughs> okay. Leave him there. Okay. So, All right. I'm, I'm yeah. carrying the kraken, right? So I just <laughs> I just keep going. Yeah. And, uh, the... I'm watching as, as yeah, as you walk away from that, you hear this ungodly shrieking oh, God. coming from that mushroom circle. Oh no. And then right. and then his scream uh <laughs> underneath, right? Yeah. Oh, it wasn't his the, the shrieking, no, the, the ungodly no, shrieking. No, 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 shri no. They're, they're no. screaming mushrooms, I think, right? Yeah, maybe, I don't know. Yeah, something like but, that. But uh I, I don't want to know. Okay. So I I I take my scabbarded sword Right as yeah. as I have the guy in, in in one arm, right, and I'm tapping the ground ahead ah, as yes. I go with my scabbarded sword because that's all I can use as right. some okay. sort of right. pole, right? Let's see yeah. if you find anything. Uh, uh -oh. You don't come across anything. Good. Is there anything? <laughs> Who <Yeah>. knows? Okay. <laughs> so you make your way down that path and out of. The East Wood. Nice. Okay. Nice. All right. So, so have... this black, the black trail is the main road into the yes. East Wood. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Down to uh, Long Fangs. Down to Long Fangs Camp. All right. All right. So you will be able to bring him back alive. Nice. 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 All right. And uh, Mar somewhere yeah. out there, Mark. Do we want to do that next time? Yeah. 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 
somewhere Martin that. and uh, Martin and the others are lost in the East Woods looking for the Kraken, and George has found him with, tra- <laughs> with strangers. Oh, it's gonna it's gonna find and, a mutant wild elf. Um, something you probably would have known, uh, Unger and George, is there is a ban- bounty for that uh, giant. Ooh. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, I'm, I'm sure Osric will want to go back and get it after he's uh, uh, already yeah. softened it's it up. I'm an official bit. giant slayer. Yeah. <laughs> cool. I assume the bounty is dead, right? There's no real use for it. No, but, but, I mean, but the long giant. fangs hunt creatures. They might be willing to oh, pay. They might be willing to oh, pay right. Osric oh, yeah. for the, the location they can of take a that wounded back giant. The trial pits. Yes, and right? uh, they might pay Osric right. well for that information, or, a wounded giant. Or maybe a wild elf. You know, we wounded it, so, yes. you know, it's, it's... You softened it up weakened. for them. Yes. Right. It's not going to last long in the trial pits, then. <laughs> <laughs> no, but 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 Osric might. They, we don't want him to get the idea That's they true. can put him in the trial pits. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. So I, I awesome. thought back a little little wild there for a while because I lose track of things. But uh, yeah, you guys made out really good. Yeah, it's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Out. Dice, man, you got to love dice. Right. And, and wounded <laughs> wounded that giant previously. Yeah. Wow. Damn. I mean, Eloy <laughs> fought like nice. a like a superhero. For crying out loud, that was nice. Nice. Yeah, that awesome. was amazing. Yeah, fun. <laughs> I like a I like a hex crawl, baby. I like a sandbox hex yeah. crawl. It's awesome. Yeah. Good. Awesome. All right, guys. Nice. Well, uh, thanks yeah. for good work. Yeah. Good work. Thank you so much. And Ella, yes. great to yeah. have you I play with. Yeah, great to have you on board. Yeah. And George, I'm glad I came, even if it was a little late. Yeah. No. Yeah. I, yeah. I was worried George wouldn't survive, so I was like, uh, no. So was I. And it's it, great because it's now we. Re- Oh, go ahead. George is the one with the love interest in this. Yes. So yes. yes. I mean, yeah. we're doing this. We're doing <laughs> this say. because of George, really. Yeah. Well, <laughs> Martin was. Martin was. Uh, Unger is doing it for the money. <laughs> right. Which there is. Oh some. yeah. Where's Hilda? Oh yeah, Hilda. Uh, show the players. Where's her picture? There she is. Oh yes. Uh, oh, that's her character sheet. I think. Yeah, you can't see her picture. Picture. <laughs> It's uh, under bio. Oh, there it is, under bio, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, there okay. she is. Yeah. 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 She's actually been around since we came to Blackfish That's Bay. Right. In nice. session 14, so she's been around for, yeah, 30 sessions. Wow. <laughs> there in the background. Nice. That's so, awesome. Nice. She That's was awesome. A, a companion of Gregor, the Kraken, but she broke ranks with him after he got Session a little bit number too. 44. What are we calling this? I don't know. What do you want to call it, guys? Uh... Instead of, let, instead of let loose the Kraken, take hold the Kraken. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Take hold take the Kraken. Take hold the Kraken. Okay. We'll or, do or, that. or Osric, giant slayer. Uh, giant vanquisher, at least. <laughs> yeah, right, right, right. You know, we ran okay, it off. We'll it's close it. enough. All right, let's okay, see. Let's get this straight. So I uh, stumble in. I almost choked to death on spores. Managed oh, to yeah. not hit the giant. Managed to not hit anything else, hardly. That's awesome. <laughs> it took, yeah. took down one guy, right? Uh, uh, one sure. bandit. Oh, yeah. 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 The, the biggest, one, the yeah. biggest and strongest bandit of the bunch I managed to pull out. Uh, I managed to get it. Okay, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll get the experience point 